Hello, everyone. <clears throat> Welcome to an evening, well, at least evening on the EST time, uh, on the Simpsons Den channel. My name is Wingless Dragon, and welcome back to MC Hub Skyblock Sun. Woo! Um, this has basically been three days in a row now. This is the third day. I'm still here. What's going on? Where are we going? Who am I? Uh, everything's going great. I hope everyone's having a wonderful night, a wonderful day, where you're at. Uh, we were busy. Uh, There's a few things that was happening today. Um, and so the plans changed a little bit where... I would have, uh, we would have generally streamed and did something uh, around the 3 o'clock mark like we usually do, uh, but uh, one of the things that happened was it was our father's birthday. <clears throat> so we wished him happy birthday, there was all that going on, uh, a few other things was happening during the day as well, um, so yeah, just wanted to uh, <laughs> wish, wish our father a happy birthday, and end up getting to, uh, getting busy with other stuff, but Tuesdays is a stream day, so we, uh, we, uh, we, we stream on Tuesdays, woo, uh, where are we at, well, uh, uh, we expanded a little bit, I started working on this last session, and we've got kind of the basis of where we're gonna put the volcano for our island, so we've got that going on, but we've also been working on our island itself, because if you check the stats, we are ranked number seven on IS top, level 96, and we're probably, I'm, I'm probably going to be able to get a little bit higher uh, during the stream, so we'll see that. Uh, I've got keys I'm going to open, and I'm going to do that right off the bat, at the beginning of the now, because well, I mean, uh, there's, there's items I want to see if I can get, and go from there. For everyone who is playing on MC Hub, Make sure that you vote. Make sure that after you vote, you do your G kits. Or watching the stream. How long are you going to be? Oh, uh, at least streaming five hours, I think. I think I'm going into uh, the Wednesdays now. Uh, so, <laughs> Mugglicious, I am definitely going to be here for a while. Uh, don't hesitate to chat in the YouTube chat. Uh, you can also chat here. Uh, I might not get all the chat through the, the, the game one. But uh, yeah, definitely be join. And uh, let me know if the quality's fine. Uh, I've decided to switch up to see if it'll be one for one uh, live. Um, so the quality, I don't know if the quality is gonna be worse, uh, but it should be, there should be no latency. So it should be interesting how that goes. Uh, yeah, all things to try. We'll see how it goes. Other than that, yeah. Gonna get the, the items from the keys. Gonna see where we're gonna progress. Um, I've got experience to add to the tools and I'll kind of show what we've been doing uh, cause you can see a bit of what we've built so far and go from there. Not much has changed in regards. Oh, I'm gonna put my armor first. <clears throat> like me some armor. Uh, so you'll see we just kind of stack some of the, our other items here. And this is mostly just to get our um, the, the tier four stuff out of the way. So what I'll probably purchase is the wither skeleton just to get the quest going on. Cause if you check quests, uh, that's where we're at right now. We finished up to boop, uh, the nether warts, which thankfully we got the nether warts. The nether warts is up and running. This is the one we use for active farming. This is kind of our stack of just like our early farm. And these are for our robots. And the reason it's this big is that eventually we'll upgrade these uh, bad boys and they're going to work uh, a lot more efficiently. Uh, same thing like last season. Go up to Emerald and then just stack as many as you can. Uh, I don't think I'll join the auction, uh, but I appreciate the offer, uh, Muggalicious. <laughs> Hassan, hello. Um... So you'll see we have the robot limit, and it was a bit of a mistake I, I was making, but I just wanted to clarify, you could put five of a particular kind of robot. So you could put five farmers, you could put five grinders, you could put five minor robots. I think we have one right here. Yeah. So if you are active with, uh, with farming uh, with your uh, robots and you want to try to optimize what you have as much as possible, 
uh, make sure that like you are able to do it, but also make sure that you have enough power. We are well in the good zones of power. Uh, we have nine mythical upgrades and one legendary, basic and common as well. Uh, we're good for eight hours. I'm good for more than the stream. So we're good. I got a barrel full of <laughs> barrel full of fuel as well. So we're good for a week, I think. Um, so we're good there. Uh, this is just mainly used for grinding so that they just kind of fall down. They beepily boop there and we go from there. What else have we been doing? Uh, oh yeah, it's, it's, I'm going to texture it and make it look better, but I finished doing the dome thing at the bottom. Uh, this will be designed a little bit more, but I just, this is just the bigger island look that I wanted to have. It's actually hollow inside. Hassan, hello. Um, so all this is going to be like transform a little bit more. I think I'm at least going to do the outline and try to have the volcano kind of at least, uh, preemptively set up and incorporate the initial island into it as well. Uh, so it'll be interesting and make this more of like a cave sort of back cave, but in a volcano type of thing. So we'll see. Well, that's my creative side of things that I want to work on. Uh, at some point, I'll look for to go into the dungeons. Dungeons have bloody... Like, dungeons have been amazing. We found great charms in there. We've gotten robots that has helped us. So if you're not doing dungeons, you should um, be able to, like, try to get the chests. Try Even just getting the fuel and then just selling them on Auction House for people that need it. Uh, works out. I think it's not the they're selling it pretty cheap now, but uh, yeah, it, it's starting to the auction house is starting to look like the what I'm used to is uh, people starting to like let go of other items, stuff like that. So it's looking good. Um, oh, if anyone is looking for an overlord rank, I have one that I will be giving away tonight. Uh, I have I have one. Uh, someone was able to. Someone I donated it. Uh, I think when I did the large, uh, the large stream that I had earlier. So I'm not gonna do it right away. It's not fair. I'm gonna wait till there's a bit more people uh, and uh, see if there's any other uh, people that are gonna need or want it. But uh, yeah, that'd be amazing. What else can I? Uh, what else am I gonna do? Yeah, that's that's where we're gonna go. If there's any items that I don't, or if I win more ranks with uh, the votes. Um, I'll generally just give them out uh, as well. I won't be really holding on to those. So for now, let's go to spawn. And just work on getting... See what kind of items I can get. Uh, not getting anything great at the moment. Woo! <laughs> uh, actually, these are always good anyway. Uh, as, as much as they're not, uh, they don't, <laughs> yeah, boy, that's a big man. Woo! <laughs> uh, do I get a rank? Do I get a rank? No, I'm just getting extra keys at the moment. Okay. So none of that. So only the one, but that'll be fine. Okay, yeah, dungeons is closing yet. Yeah. Okay, so I will be waiting a little bit longer for the dungeon later on. That's fine. Uh, let's see if I can get any uh, robots. <laughs> a, few, a few robots, actually. That's good. Another iron robot. Good. I'll see what they are later. Legendary. No. no uh, XL shard pouch. That's good. <laughs> a royal key gave me two more legendaries. Sure. Ooh, emerald. And... Another XO. Okay. So the items have been pretty good. Miner, uh, emerald miner. That's fine. Another miner, a grinder, and another grinder. So a gold grinder in the end. Uh, Yeah, that's not bad. Uh, the, the wand. We, we, we were lucky enough to get the infinite wand from the beginning. So we don't actually need those. Where are the big XLR shards are going to be interesting? Um, At some point, I'll probably start trying to uh accumulate those a lot but i think for now just because it's it's just useful to have um i just open them up might as well pew, 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 pew. 
Uh, I was saying it before, but definitely make sure that you vote every day. Get that streak going. Um, and then if you check, so that's all I got from the spawners. You want to check the chat. Uh, lots of, sp wow, a lot. Every booster was a spawner booster. Okay. Didn't get much from the large shard pouches, so boo. But I'll take what I can get. If I check auction house, is there anything of value here? No. Not even able to get. Nah, that's good. Although I could, I could get another netherite one right now. Nah, that's fine because I have one of those later. Nah, we're good. Uh, I'll probably just merge it with what I have later. Yeah, yeah. So make sure to vote again. You can see that I'm on day four of the streak. Day four. Yeah, day four, I guess. Uh, and so that streak's going strong. I have 20, uh, sorry, 35 vote tokens. I've also done the ad token things as well. It's super simple. You go see the ad, you get the token. Um, this one's actually pretty reasonable because I will, once I get to the 14 day, uh, streak, I will be looking to, uh, to get all of that spent and get that going so that we can move forward for the uh, premium coin pack and god knows how many um tokens we'll end up getting by that time so yeah that's gonna be a phenomenal way of just getting loads of uh coins uh i do plan on making a video uh to update on how to get free ranks and free gold coins and that's literally one of the methods easily uh but just voting is one of the ways you may not have a chance from the vote keys. And then even if you don't, maybe you're just the most unluckiest person. The fact that they've given you tokens uh, to be able to get things moving forward as well, to eventually use to spend on getting freaking premium currency is phenomenal. Uh, so that's really great to have. And uh, once you have that, It'll let you move forward type of thing. So yeah, there you go. Muggalicious just won an extra vote key just from voting. Woo! Anyway, yeah. So definitely if you are just try uh, like just starting things out, you'll know that that's, that's going to be a method for you to move forward on. So worth, worth it. Yeah. 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 Okay. So I'm going to make my way back to the island uh see what robots i have that i haven't used uh okay grinder yeah okay so we definitely have an obby going up there uh grinder grinder boom grinder boom so we have another emerald uh no we have a bedrock one over there we probably should keep this will be something to look into as well. Um, and go from there. Accumulating these still for now. Actually, one of the things that's been hilarious is the the lack of collection boxes we've not gotten. Uh, that one's been funny. Uh, where's... Yeah, this is the one that I just want to merge. We might give those away at some point because we definitely don't need any of these. Uh, oh, yeah, fun fact. You can technically level up a uh, cell wand to uh, to get experience, uh, but don't do it. And the way that you can do it, I'm not going to tell you how to do it. It's a bug. Um, it's already I'm already being told that they're going to fix it. Uh, so if you like waste your time on it, it'll be it's just not worth it. Don't don't bother. So don't. Uh, but yeah, it was just weird that I I saw that that was happening. I'm like, uh. Why? <laughs> so, uh, we are not going to level up that. We will, however, put that in and be able to condense them all. So now that we have it up to rare, cool. Because, you know, we need more time for, for, for that to go, uh, to get moving. Uh, so one of the things I've been working on uh, off screen is uh, just grinding, trying to get through the different masteries. So now, um, the masteries, if we go through them, 
we finished up all of the ones that we needed to do uh, for the pets. It does okay. Here's here's a bit of an information thing that I think is misleading for some people, and I just want uh, maybe clarify that for people. Uh, unlike the uh, the crop masteries, to get to the next level of items. Uh, to get to the next tier of items, it is not just a matter of getting th one of the tiers of the mobs. If you go to shop and you highlight spawners, you have to actually get 150, uh, sorry, 150, uh, 15,000 kills instead of 1,000 kills to progress to the next. And you'll know your progress for unlocking the next level at the bottom of uh, the box that gets highlighted and it goes the same thing for each one as well so that's where you're going to get the information there and then once you select uh, the mobs you'll see how the mobs work with the stacks individually you'll also you'll see that there's different tiers for the mobs themselves and once you start getting more spawners and the amount that you've killed you'll be able to get extra drops that'll help you uh moving forward uh, yeah, you know what? I don't think we have anything of surprise right now. So I don't mind doing the island unlock for a little bit. Uh, that's not. Uh, boop. there you go. If you can, can you come to my island? So everyone can have uh, can check out the island real quick. We don't have anything of a surprise, and frankly, I'm streaming it as well, so it's not like you're gonna get a surprise at all. Uh, nothing is. We haven't done anything new actually from what we've done last season. Uh, we've always had like a little module thing here for our for our um, <laughs> for our mobs, the blazes drop uh blaze powder instead of blaze rods um uh, so we ended up having to have just a hopper system to pick them up because the mob hoppers wasn't picking them up uh that's that's been informed to them they're gonna i believe look into that uh what else is there uh yeah otherwise we just have the ore hoppers back here picking up whatever we grind there and then we have a basic hopper here uh, to pick up uh, the cactuses that are up here. And then, where's the other one? I have another one somewhere. Crop, 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 crop. Oh, yeah. Uh, underneath our, where we do the farming. We're going to probably do more levels of these once the, our tool is in a better shape. But because we have to keep replanting, we're, it's not relevant to update it. But these ones are uh, crop hoppers as well. And we just kind of did a little stair method. But you could do similar to... Uh, the stack uh, method that we've done, like, here. Uh, well, maybe not that one specifically, but, uh, like, here. Just to get the hoppers moving down, stuff like that. Yeah, if anybody needs to... Oh, people might need, um... Skeletons. Do I still have my skeletons with me? Uh, yes, I do. Uh... Uh... Eh? There you go. So, in case people need skeletons... Uh, drops, that'll do it too. I will, however, sell... Uh, I need to sell... So, I'm gonna go do that. Ooh. Go in here. No, you'll see that I'm moving the charm around because we have one and I just like to have the condense uh, done for the robots. Note that this is only uh, able, currently, you're only able to do this for the owner of the island. Everyone else is unable to move charms unless it's their specific robot. And even then, I think there is a issue. Um, so be mindful of that. But if you are the owner of the island and you have charms, it's good to just kind of move around and get the items condensed because you do get a lot more uh, from it. 
Do 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 do. How much are you holding? Yeah, not much, but that's fine. Wrong one. Cool. Uh, I think that's put. Uh, yeah, it's all, all the robots are. Uh, yeah, I did it to all the robots. Good. So I'll be able to. I should be getting over a billion. Uh, this time around. So let's let's see. Get the booster. Oh, uh, you know what? I could sell the robots uh, with the two time multiplier. Yeah. Oh, we did make that bigger. Uh, booster. Activate. You. You're the two times. Yee, fall down. 280 million, 278 million, 280 million, 280 million, 240 million. Yeah, 1.5 billion. Sweet. Uh, that's another 48 million. That's good. Oh, that's good, actually. I was not expecting that. Uh, no, you go there. I don't think we have much out of these, I think. That's fine. Cool. Uh, and then where's the cactus farm? Cactus farm is good. Once we can get... We don't have a condensed wand. Once I think we have a condensed wand for cactuses, we're going to have a bigger farm going on with that, I think. And that's really going to set ourselves apart um, at that point. Uh, yeah. I think we are good there. And yeah, another warts are giving us a few million as well. So once we can get uh, our tool fixed up for that, nether warts will be definitely an area where we can grind quite a lot. Uh, so that's going to be an interesting... Oh, yeah. I guess I could sell you. forgot you're a robot. Uh, I like is literally just staring at me and be like, why aren't you selling me? Uh, woo! Um, so yeah. I think I've got everything sorted out there. Uh, boop you there, boop you there. Color, yeah, we're good there. Cool. I'm going back to the hub, and the reason why I'm going back to the hub is to reset the booster that I have. But with that, this means that I have... 1.7 billion dollars. So yeah, our island is definitely progressing forward very well. I would upgrade up the island, but we need wither skeletons. So how much it's 1 billion for one? Well, there we go. Got a wither skeleton now. That was expensive. But that's fine. The rest of it, though, is going to go to the, uh, go to the island. Oh, man. I'm not even going to have enough for, uh, <laughs> for 100, but that's fine. We will get there. See, I would have been able to get a lot higher. Well, not by much. With the billion, probably 103. But, uh, no. I'm okay with, uh, 99 for now. Uh, we'll be able to accumulate a little bit more and move ahead, but, uh, yeah. You can see that, like, we're really coming close to a lot of the members... Uh, the other island members that are in the, the same range as we are. And even the top island right now is 136. And I think that's what's crazy this season. Is is that. Is that this season there's a lot going on. That has made it a lot more. It's slower. But I think it's more. The progress of it is more fun. And I think that's kind of the, what I've been able to showcase with all of these streams day to day is that that's going on. Um, so yeah, it's been pretty cool on that front uh, with where we're going. Uh, for everyone that's already joined us in the chat, hello, hope you're doing well. If you haven't already messaged in the chat, sound out in the, in the YouTube chat. And uh, you know what? Uh, send a 
Yeah, you know, let's keep it simple. Send a heart emoji. Yeah, in the YouTube chat. Send a heart emoji. Yeah, heart emoji. Woo. <laughs> We've got everyone. Got a bunch of people. We've got us on. Muggalicious. Your boy, the the Pikmin. I think there was someone else. Yeah, Thorat's. Thorat will be joining us a little bit later. He's just kind of standing there right now. Uh, but he's wrapping up some stuff as well. Woo. And yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, if anytime you teleport to an island, you sometimes just like go merge, you fall down in the little uh, area there. That's fine. Uh, what to do now? Uh, <clears throat> yeah, actually I want to show the farming hill right now. Uh, yeah, so if I have it at level 67, and it's just been progressively getting better because of the... <laughs> yeah, I got a heart, woo! Yeah, boy, the Pikmin did the first heart. Nice. Yes, I actually do have spare. I am okay with sparing a bit of fuel. Uh, gift. Son. Ooh, all right, farming time. We need more hearts in the the YouTube chat, though. Come on, people, gotta get all them hearts in the chat. But yeah, so green thumb has been one of the more important tools right now that I've been trying to accumulate. Uh, the reason why is that once we can get that to a hundred. That's going to be a huge help with not only getting uh, resources from the nether wards, but just leveling up the tool itself. Um, and I've been confirmed that you can get more than 100, uh, per, uh, 100 levels on a tool. So I think at the end of the day, you could literally level up every enchantment, which I think that's one thing that's super cool uh, for all the tools uh, this season. Is that you can level them up to max. Uh, right now, see, this is all from Green Thumb, and because, and that's because my Green Thumb right now is 32. That's uh, because, and it goes up to 50. So I have about 64% that it'll replant uh, automatically. Um, so it's not perfect right now, and so that's why I'm not building any more uh, floors. <clears throat> but once I do, uh, our tools are definitely going to get maxed out. Uh, for that, I think you should be able to and be able to marry your siblings if you can. There's nothing wrong with them. I have no idea what that why that's a thing. Uh, if it's with my sibling, that ain't happening. Uh, I think that's uh, not a issue. I, uh, definitely threw me off on the side with that uh, SPC Kermit. Uh, May start with a high next time. <laughs> um, no, uh, I think genetically there's still an issue. Uh, I believe from what was going on, uh, if you look at things genetically, they've proven that there are issues uh, with long-term is problems with that. Uh, it's actually one of the things that was uh, what was going on with royalty back in the days where even if one person seemed that they were okay uh, because they were inbreeding so much, it ended up causing a lot of issues. So it's actually still something that is fundamentally a uh, problem. And can uh, I think one of the concerns with that is the fact that they've you can also... Um, cr it causes uh, deformations or mutations that actually make it r r worse. So not sure <laughs> why... You brought that up, but yeah, no, I think there is more medical concerns of it well past what can be initially seen early on. So, no, I think it's not something to be, uh, to do, but that is my opinion. I think others have other opinion, but I'd be very concerned because it might I would hate to see the later generations of a family group 
uh, be affected because of that. With that uh, random topic uh, out of the way. Uh, so yeah, so the farming aspect of things is a little bit slow, but once I can level up this fast enough, it's gonna help us move forward quickly with getting all of the tools that we need. Uh, yes, another green thumb. So now I'm at 66% with the uh, 33 going strong. Doop doop. I'm disappointed in chat. They only sent, only your boy Pikmin ended up giving uh, the heart. I don't know. Might might just give the Overlord rank to him. Them, sorry. <laughs> I'm gonna say them because I don't know if it is who they are specifically. So, uh, so yeah, this is slow. It, it actually been taking a while, uh, and there was a lot of replanting that needed to be done. <laughs> uh, I can't chat on live stream chat, so I could. Oh, okay, that might be a uh, uh, a blocker thing. Okay, I get it. That makes sense. So anybody who's been needing uh, just to get the weather skeletons out of the way. Uh, What did they drop? Gas tears. Oh, okay. Wait, how many is this for the quest? Okay. At least that won't take long, so that's good. Uh, where's the skeleton spawning, though? Like how everyone's just destroying the zombie. <laughs> The skeleton's not spawning. Is it because it's too close? Maybe. Put a huge step? Or, no, there shouldn't be. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. Oh, there we go, yeah. Okay, good. Now now people can deal with the skeletons themselves. So that'll help people. Yeah. And skeletons I don't really need. So that's fine. Cool. So anybody who needs to deal with the skeletons, they'll be able to do that uh, at the moment. Uh, oh, I sold the nether warts. No, that's fine. There's like bunches of them trailing, I think. Or did they disappear already? They might have disappeared already. That's fine. I can go get some more. Cool. Do, do, do. Ah, you almost fell. So yeah, once I can get the green thumb to 100%, or sorry, to level 50, which will mean 100%, um, that's going to make this process so much faster. It's already much faster now to replant. Um, it's just, you'll see that I've done two levels, or you saw that I've done two levels, but I'm only focusing on one level predominantly, uh, just because I need to replant them anyway, so... If I don't just replant them, like I might as well just replant them at this point. So um, I'll just work off of one. It's long enough where it, like it levels up the thing pretty quickly, and it 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 does increase how much experience you need over time. But given that, like, if you get like crop drill expanded. And you're able to get a lot more done once it replants. It's going to get to a point where if you have enough of the layers, you're just going to be non-stop with the farming. 
and it's going to be so good to to get it done. I think crop drill. What's my crop drill now? Crop drill's a twenty six, and it's doing one chunk. So I think if crop drill do, uh, gets to max, it's going to uh, be huge. AFK, AFK, what? Yeah, so at least that's going to help you guys out uh, for any of the quests that you're going to be dealing with. If you're handling the weather quests, I think you need at least uh, 85. So even if you kill them ahead of time, I think afterwards you only need to kill them once. And it'll trigger the whole thing. Uh, I think the same thing for like cobblestone. Like If you've like m dealt with all of the cobblestone stuff... Even at the later quests, you'll just automatically unlock them. It's going to be weird. Um, sure. So Hassan has a question. We'll see what the question is. Uh, can you come to my island? Fast place dirt like a lot for a farm. You would have to give access to place blocks. In general, I could, but you're also leaving yourself open to people going to your island and just dropping anything there. So you're gonna have to be, you have, you're gonna have to make sure that you like lock it and unlock it quickly if you want me to do that, Hassan. Do, 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 do. Also, for everyone who's watching right now, uh, how's the latency compared to... Uh, uh, I could... Just let me finish this. Oh, that's what you meant for AFK. You were just, like, heading away from it. Got it. Uh, yeah, so Hassan, give me a second. Uh... What are they gonna do? I mean, I can't place blocks if you don't if you don't unlock the setting for me to place blocks on your island. But that means everyone places blocks on your island, so that's where you might have to be careful. And no, I can't leave my island to join yours. I'm literally the leader of my island. Just to preemptively. Oh man, I'm already. I need more words. Uh, no, I'm just gonna finish that before I forget. I don't need that many, but that's fine. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. um I do want to thank everyone who's uh, subscribed uh, as of lately. Uh, we've gotten, it's been a slow rise since, uh, since October. But we are still moving forward with subscribers. You guys have been awesome with that. So I just want to say thank you. You'll see a bunch of people uh, at the bottom of the, the screen that have not only subscribed, but we did have three official members of the Denizens now uh, join us. And I want to thank them again. Um, oh, well, actually, one's all, only one is listed there. Unfortunately, I don't know why uh, Thorad is not listed. Uh, but there's Thorad, there's uh, Jared and Bicious, and Fridgemont Fanatic that are sponsors. Uh, it's a sponsors there, but they've joined uh, the Denizens on uh, YouTube. So it's very much appreciated. And also the recent uh, donation from uh, Countdown as well. So that's been awesome. Uh, boop. I think everyone's done with skeletons, so I can put you away. Boop. Just put spawners there. Yeah. Uh. It thinks it wants. It thinks it wants to kill. Uh, no, I'm gonna put it there, that's fine. Uh, yeah. 
All right, let's go see Hassan's Island. Ice Warp. Uh, star. Oh, it's doing that again. Message. I'll be able to. So this is what the island usually looks like. So there we go. And I've completely obliterated my thing. Uh, but what's cool, for those that are curious, this is actually set up like a cobble gen. So that, you can mine it and it'll like switch up. And so will that block. Because it'll touch this uh, water as well. So it's funny to have like the, the, the differences of the two at the same time. So yeah. Which one is for block place? What do you mean? Oh, for the setting. Uh, if I go to... Uh, because it's going to be break blocks because I'm going to, well, actually, I shouldn't need to break any blocks. Uh, so there should be a place one. Uh, no. Anvil's armor, biome control, break blocks. Uh, brewing, furnace, dropper. Uh, Pick up, no, no. Oh, it's the, uh, if you go to the next page, it's the one that's, that says place blocks. You'd have to allow visitors to place blocks. And then also let me pick up dirt. Although I can probably buy dirt as well. So go to island control panel, go to island menu. Go to island flag, go to next page, and then set this to visitor uh, to be allowed to play stuff. Oop, there you go. So I can place blocks now. But I don't think I can break them. Nope, that's fine. So I just have to be careful. Alright, where do you need it? Where do you need me to place it? I can help you, but you're gonna have to tell me... Where to place the dirt? Where or down here? So in this chunk. If you want it within the chunk, I can put it. Nod yes for in chunk. Or do you want it more closer to the... Uh, connected to the island? Perfect. All right. Um, I'll do it at the. That seems to be. Uh, stream. Oh, so there's still the stream delay. Okay. Interesting. I'll have to look more into that. Okay. And then I'm just going to do this. Cool. Uh, fast place. 
15. Oh, it doesn't let me fast place. Interesting. I can't fast place on an island that doesn't belong to me. Good to know. Uh-oh. Too far. Okay, well... So much for fast place uh, being vi viable on other people's island. Good to know. I didn't know that. Uh, I didn't think that that was taken into consideration, but I guess it's good so that people don't get uh, abused. But I can fly and go in circles, so I can literally do that at least, and then it will be the full chunk uh, from here, so you'll be able to kind of figure out where all the other chunks are going to be at afterwards. can't fast place but at least i can show the chunk so this is the whole chunk ignore that little bit that i accidentally placed but this whole bl this whole cube is the chunk itself so if you know from this point on if you want to chunk this way uh no but you do hit the uh hit the grass if you destroy the grass itself, you'll end up getting the seeds from that. Uh, you also can get seeds from the wheat that is back here from your farm as well. So it's actually one of the first things that I, I, I realized uh, I could do really quickly. Where it was just like a matter of doing that. Mind you, what am I saying? I could, pretty sure I could shop. Which is expensive for no reason, but. Yeah, they're a million dollars. What the heck? Anyway, here you go. I spent a million on you. <laughs> Enjoy. That, that's the most expensive seeds in the world. Uh, you're probably going to need this later, too. So I'm just going to give you this now. Don't sell those. You'll need them later. Okay. Going back to the island. Woo. Uh, yeah. I think I'm going to close the island up now that everyone's had their... They're fun. Cool. Uh, don't need this right now. Cool. Have a good one, uh, Mugglicious. Bye. Uh, I'm going to... Okay, so my goal is really just to try to get right now to level up the... Uh, the farming house, so I can get that out of the way as much as possible. Um, I'm doing this alongside just kind of like the robots gaining their money as well. Level 69. Yeah. That's a good number. Gotta get 69 numbers. Cool. And all the extra... Nether warts that doesn't get picked up. I need to find a way to get myself a uh, a collection box, though. That's the only thing that I'm missing right now. Eh. Is a collection box. Yeah. Yeah, Hassan. No one's gonna buy. No one's gonna buy fuel for five thousand when everything else is that that cheap for four hundred and five hundred. Uh, fuel is not rare anymore from people. Uh, Myth Mystic Rank? That's a really good price. That's the other thing, too. Uh, and that's actually something I might update uh, people on as well. Is there's chances where people are selling ranks very cheaply. 
and just getting a mystic rank just so you can get the flying is worth checking out yeah there's two people there's two people selling it at like a reasonable rate i think there's more yeah so you can easily get a good rank get get a rank pretty easily uh at least up to mystic which will let you at least do the flying and i think that that's gonna help a lot wow that's way too expensive um i absolutely need a yeah my biggest my biggest hurdle right now is not having a collection box of all things uh which sucks Ooh, five royal keys is actually not I need the scuff at. But the whole refarming part is a little annoying. But it is getting to the point where it's it's only filling up little holes. While before it was like replanting the whole uh the whole area and it was just getting annoying. Uh, but now it's 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 not as bothersome because I get back on being able to uh, farm the nether warts uh, right after. So it's been pretty good on that front. Uh, I might need more crop hoppers. Uh, I know you're rich in shards probably, so you'll be uh, on AH. So if you see a legend rank, legend rank is not going to be there uh, anytime soon, I think. Uh, if it is, you're probably they're probably gonna oversell it. Uh, cause right now over uh overlord rank, if you check. Uh, I think I just saw Overlord. They're doing 90,000. So Legend, if they end up having it for free, they're probably going to request it for gold coins instead. Um, which would be a smart deal, because if you go to coin shop and you see the ranks. Uh, legend to upgrade is a thousand gold coins. They could easily, easily look to get 400, 500 gold coins, uh, without a problem, uh, for a legend rank, but that'll depend on people that actually have gold coins to trade. Um, so far people who have been putting gold coins on the auction house, uh, they've started increasing it a little bit because it's getting a little bit easier to get shards. Uh, but it's the best that I've seen in a long time for the economy of uh, gold coins on the auction house uh, for, for Skyblock that I've seen in a long time. Usually, like, people are already, like, within the same day are already in, like, the 100,000 shards for, like, just 100 uh, unlike prison prisons where beacons are are around for a while. Do 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 do. Ended up taking a nap before, uh, just to kind of rest up a little bit because I've been I've been kind of a little bit nonstop because I've had I did some editing and released uh, the video for the other. Uh, server that I play on also, which is OP Legends. Um, I did, there's a video that I had, uh, wanted to complete. And I released that on, uh, Saturday before I did the live stream of MC Hub. Then for some reason it was crazy and I was like, yeah, let's stay on MC Hub for as long as I did. Um, so that was interesting. Um, <laughs> and then ended up doing another live stream later on. Really having fun though. Um, it's, it's been good to chat with a few people as well. Um, not just about MC Hub stuff, but just general chatting as well. Um, I don't know. It's been good to see, uh, where things can be when, even when there's like major significant changes to a server and, but what's great. I think I like about the changes on MC Hub this season is there f i'm familiar with what direction i need to go to but it is still very much a different feel on how to get there and i think that that's fun 
Uh, I know a lot of people don't like this, but I'm actually really happy they removed PvP. I think the idea of PvP... Like, I understand people like PvP, but I think a lot of people were focused too much on it and less on what Skyblock should be. And it's like, hey, Skyblock should be Skyblock. I think it makes sense for PvP to be present on prisons because, like, the term prisons, you're trying to, like... You're dealing with gang fights. You're dealing with like stuff like that. So that being more PvP and having items um, available to find and stuff like that there makes sense to me. But on a Skyblock, I've always I've always seen Skyblock as being like a collective group of people trying to like increase their their standing for their island as fast as possible or as, as effective as possible type of thing, right? And so it's more interesting to me on that. But I'm also like a very much on more on the creative side of things. So that's probably the reason why I see the the more the, the increased benefits of it on uh, on just in general. So uh, yeah, been. But I one thing I will say is I do like. Uh, the dungeons, and I like that the dungeons aren't consistently the same all the time. You either get the, uh, the jungle, uh, one, or you get the, the, I guess I call it, like, the cave. There's the cave and then the jungle. So you've got, uh, or not the cave, more like the pyramid, or inside the pyramid one. Uh, with all the sandstone and stuff like that. So, like, I like the mix of it. I think the mix of it is good. Um, so yeah. Okay, we're gonna... Uh, nope, you. And still got a bit of you guys here. Cool. Yeah, so that's still faster than... Uh, than the usual. Okay, now I need to figure out how I'm going to... How I'm going to get moving forward. That, yeah, I'm glad the Wither Skeleton's there as well, so I can just get this out of the way. Uh, not that I need to... Yeah, I might as well put the bones here. On the off chance that I need it. Where is the spare bone? Yeah, there we go. And the bucket goes into the bone. Yeah, there we go. Do, 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 do. Yeah. Um, I'm definitely going to remove these guys at some point. But I'm not too, too bothered just yet. I do need to figure out how I'm going to get the skeletons design. Uh, skeleton. The layout design. Good. So that's done with the. Ooh, I'm almost at the diamond. Maybe I should try to get that out of the way. Credit boosters. Cool. Not sure what I'm gonna do with the credit booster, but okay. Well, I've I've got other ones, so but that's good. But you get credit boosters, or you get any kind of boosters of a high level if you claim the G kits every time you vote. So a reminder for people: once you vote, do G kits, and you'll get a grinder one. But you'll get a little di uh, emerald that'll appear as well. The grinder kit is if you bought the grinder kit, by the way. Uh, and then that'll work itself out. But no, yeah, I want to test how fast things are at the moment with uh, 
with that because I'm almost done the diamond one and I think our island is in a decent shape to go through everything pretty quickly. And it'll just be a matter of like trying to find the diamonds more actively. You can get a uh, a um, a generate a ore generator to uh, to gain like the the specific diamond ores themselves for the quest, but uh, you're better off just having a really good pickaxe and a really long uh, cobble gen, or even like this one's long enough for what we need to do to level up not only the pickaxe but the actual. Uh, coverage of everything as well. And then we have all the... Um, we have the ore hoppers just picking up everything. Anyway, so we are good on that front. Yeah, I just saw that I got one of the diamonds now. So it's annoying. You definitely need to level up your island to get more of a chance on it. Uh, not mastery quest. Uh, but know that whatever amounts that you... 69. Yeah! Another 69. That's two 69s today. Woo! Did they add something? Add what? Oh, if you're talking about the, uh, the gen thing? No, it's been there for... since last season. The ore generators... Oh, yes, PvE does not lose your stuff anymore. Uh, that's been that's been uh, updated to match what Prisons has for uh, PvE. So, no, you will no longer be losing items at all uh, in PvE if you die. So, you can go back there and just deal with the mobs themselves. Like I said, they've made it. A, a, it's been on prisons for a while now, so it's fair. But B, it's design again. They fixed up things on with with MC Hub, where it's still familiar, but you are gaining. The focus is more again on building the island itself, and less of like. Just trading and getting all the resources, the money from doing other uh, the same action over and over again, and then your your eyes top. This focuses a lot more with the actual island itself being um, move, move, uh, actually moving forward. I just realized I'm gonna have to check the uh, denizens emojis as well because I think I can add more now that I have three. Ooh, I'm gonna have to look into that. It might be five, but I'm gonna I'm gonna have to confirm that. That just made me, that just reminded me afterwards. Yeah. Anyway. I'm gonna have to... I'm gonna have to get Thorad to, uh... Post, uh, Siblings Den emoji. Oh, okay. So the ore is starting to... Get maxed out now. waste yeah 70 i wow all throughout that time i only got that so i do have 30 to do um i'm not gonna do them right now it's gonna be a little too hectic to do uh but i've leveled this up uh no ace three wait so if that gives me ace three now is this going to be... F no, this is going to be faster, isn't it? Yep. So, haste on this is good. Efficiency on this is good. Uh, yeah, no. That is good. Because people were losing items just from trying to, like, complete simple tasks in PvE. 
Um, and, like, if you keep losing your items just, like, on trying to, like, kill the weather that is there, the boss, it's the... Yes, that's normal. That's the same... That's the same as everyone else. Everyone has to do that. It's not a matter of just buying shards and plopping it to 100 or immediately. Um, so this actually... This prevents it from being a PvP... Sorry, a play, pay to win mechanic now. So everyone has to level that up. Everyone has to work to put souls on it uh, on their own. And that's what makes that a lot more fair to everyone. And already you can see that it's a big deal because people on IS Top are only at 130, 140. They're not at 300 already. So it's really made things... Uh, it's paced the server a lot, and I like it a lot. Does it suck individually? A little bit. But if you look at it as a whole, it's fair. Because it's not just you who's dealing with that. Someone could buy all of the all of the items and all of the ranks and all of the things that they want. They're still going to have to level up the sword manually. The most that can happen is someone else that builds it for them, and that person sells that sword to them. But by the time someone spent that much uh, time on it, um, they're going to be using it at this time. I expect that maybe this will be a thing later on, where people are going to sell equipment that is like at, at a high tier, but not right now. I don't see that happening right now. Ooh. Efficiency, please. So yeah, still working on the pickaxe to be more efficient. Uh, the diamonds are going to be a little bit annoying, but it's going to be just a matter of time. Thankfully, the number of diamonds is not that high. Uh, but just the amount of times you're going to get the diamond ore appearing is low, so that's the problem there. So that's the only issue that we're going to have. Kevin Council, hello! Do you have a spare sky god? Uh, yeah, actually I can give you... I can help you with that. Uh, bit of, bit of, bit of. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, quest. Yeah, so we three. Yeah, so it's gonna be slow, but I could do that. I could do that eventually. Um, so I'm not too too worried about the diamond. Uh, the diamond quest as much as anything else. Oh, I think the. I'll push him away a little bit. Oh, no, you're still getting... Let's see what happens. Okay, do this. Uh, kits. No, sorry, PV1. Uh, Sky Guy Plus, here we go. Yeah. Gift, gift. Uh, can cancel. And confirm. You. There you go. Uh, did I level this up? No problem. go let's see if I, can, I really want to get the farming tool leveled up to a point where I can uh, shoot crop drill yeah I guess I'm gonna go with that one um, I did want more yeah, it's 
to be more than enough netherworths to wrap this up. Cool. Yeah, so hopefully once it can get it to 100%, I'm going to build this up a little bit higher. Uh, up to a certain amount of layers and what's going to be great about it is that um, a it's gonna it'll be ready or it's gonna be in a good shape for when we reach um, we can get a few collection boxes and get ourselves moving forward with uh, just collecting all of the nether warts and being able to sell them because they're stacked enough right now on on the on its own that it makes us about a million when we sell them uh, per chest uh, which is like, I mean, it's pretty good early on, but when you can condense them, it ends up adding to like five, 10 million. Uh, sorry. Like it's almost like nine times or 10 times or something like that. So it goes from like 1 million to 10 million. And, uh, that can end up being a significant amount of funds when you're selling a whole thing, uh, going strong. So that's the goal on that. Uh, but we would need a condensed wand uh, on that front. So it'll be... Uh, we're pending on that as well. But I do expect that we'll be able to get one at some point. So I'm not so bothered yet with that. Uh, but we will be well on our way for that. And then that's going to be one of the methods for loads of, uh, of funds... And just leveling up the tool to the point where uh, extending crop drill and everything is just going to eviscerate a farm that we might actually make this farm even longer. Uh, but it'll depend on what uh, how we set up our our uh, at the bottom to pick up everything because that's where we're gonna have difficulty then. So yeah, fun times. But that would help us a lot. And then we would just have a farming hoe that would be the best for uh, getting all of the funds that we need easily. Think no. Oh, it'll be nice when I don't have to fill up patchy holes, but it is in the right direction. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So might as well get this going. Wow. Yeah, so it's 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 catching up. Like I was at I was at like filling it up at like seven thousand now. Now it's like nine thousand. So it's take it's getting more and more difficult to level up. But at the same time, it's kind of leveling at the same speed as like me being able to get crop drill and more green thumb. So. I feel it's getting in the right direction. It will be interesting to have max crop drill as well, though, because it means that it's going to literally take both chunks. And that's when you can just get like the length of a farm built out once and then boom, like you're you're in great shape this whole time. Um, so that one's going to be an interesting moment once we get there. 
Uh, but I'm pretty sure others have gotten there already. And they are probably making quite a bit of money or funds from that. But the fact that it's it, it's just one of many means to grind and get money. Uh, I think if you got someone dedicated nonstop, that's when it's really going to like set itself apart. Um, uh, one million for a panda spawner. Is there a way I can... Apologies if I'm quiet for a second. I'm eating cheese. Um, I brought food at the same time uh, for streaming, so I ended up... So I know that I have uh, the food with me. Uh, Hassan, check your gifts. Do-do-do... Uh, but just a uh, heads up for those who are not aware, uh, they've removed being able to trade uh, credits this season. Uh, they actually forgot. <laughs> they mentioned it, and they forgot to remove it when things started. Um, and then they removed it really quickly afterwards. Um, so, but no. Uh, again, the idea is that people make their money from the island themselves. The most someone can do to sort of trade money wise is to be able to trade an item that has the equivalent value so maybe they'll give you like a stack of enchanted uh something or other to, to equ equate to what um what could be purchased so that's the equivalent that i've seen people try to do with trading um which I mean, it's 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 a roundabout way of doing it, and I don't think a lot of people will want to do it that way, but uh, it could be a thing that ends up being something we'll look into. Uh, maybe we'll they'll prevent trading crops. I don't know. Is this available for Bedrock? Yes, it is. A lunch, cha. Wow, I cannot pronounce that. I apologize. Android Ambitious. Hello, Thorad. Hello. Nice. Ooh. So, yeah, Android Ambitious and Thorad are denizens. Thank you again. And hello. Was IP uh, for better? Oh, good question. Let me see if I can get that real quick. Because uh, they don't provide it on their information. For some reason, uh, I don't know if is it on their store as well? Uh, no, I don't know. She, uh, no, it's not from that. Let me search real quick. Uh, bedrock IP. Uh, yeah, okay, so for, for Bedrock players, the Bedrock port, uh, that's listed is, uh, 19132, um, and then the IP is, so, oh, I mean, I could have, oh, well, uh, just do the space away from Bedrock. But what I meant to do is that. No, not a problem. If it means that you're going to enjoy it uh, with everyone else, I think it's worth it. 
Uh, I'm gonna put the back there though. Boop and boop. Boop, 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 boop. It's the same one as uh, one you use. Uh, Kevin, uh, yes, Kevin Counts, if you're talking about the kit that I gave you earlier, yes, it is. Uh, so that's that. Yeah. Boop, boop, boop. Uh,. Yeah, I'm gonna wait till that grows a little bit. Uh, I don't need these right now. These guys are probably already. Yeah, it's, they've already accumulated a, a bit. And good. Okay, you're stacking. So this will be good for uh, for Thorad later on with his uh, being able to gra uh, get that out of the way for the quest. As well, so that's gonna be good. I really gotta figure out where. Okay, so okay, I can at least do the outline of where I think I want to start the uh, the volcano. Uh, ooh, oh yeah, that was from when I built that. I gotta remember that for the inside of here later. Uh, um, 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 I'll yeah, just buy more. Yeah, there we go. So I want to kind of outline, I was just po uh, popping by briefly for the rest of the stream. Hello to Thorad when he joins. Yeah. <laughs> the person you just told the Bedrock IP, can you ask them if they want to join my island? I mean, let them join first. I'm not gonna. Uh, I'm not just gonna have them join any other island right now. It's not fair. I. So, oh, the servers launched a long time ago. Uh, I've this is season 13 for Skyblock. Uh, their prisons is like season 17, 25. Like they've been there for a, a while, and I've done videos on Skyblock Sun and prisons for a while now as well uh i think it's almost it's well over a year going now at this point but they've been active for a while if you check the numbers uh they're not bad uh with the amount of people they've definitely lost numbers with a lot of the changes that they've made but i think it's gonna benefit them more so in the end than um um than before so we'll see where things progress at that point uh okay so i definitely oh i should get my pickaxe actually pickaxe where are you e. but this season the, the whole enchantment system i love the direction they went with this uh because it's just it's just crazy um how much of it that they've done uh that really builds the designs like a more fair way even for like pay pay to win players it's made free to free to play uh players a lot more able to do things without needing to pay so much and there's already there's always been methods on mc hub to be able to really um gain ranks gain currency without having to uh pay money at all so i'm actually impressed with the direction uh that they've gone is that a good surrounding yeah more or less i mean it's gonna be a volcano so it's not like volcanoes are perfectly circled uh i'm gonna be busting that at some point anyway so Oh no, I wanted, I did want to sort of incorporate that on the side. Uh, okay, so we're going to do it from here, I think. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. I like that. That's going to be good. Cool. 
Joseph McHugh. Hello and welcome. I hope all of you are doing great and you're having a great night, day. Uh, depends on whenever you're up. Uh, for me, it's Eastern Center time and it's already 11. Uh, but we this, this is like a later uh, stream uh, than my usual. But uh, we usually do 3 p.m. EST. Uh, but today has just been a big thing, like I mentioned, and I'll do another shout out. It was my father's birthday, um, so uh, we kind of got had uh, other things that come up uh, for today. But aside from that, uh, still wanted to do a stream, so I did. Woo! But I hope all of you are good. And yeah, I think that'll be a good basic surround. And then it'll be a matter of just trying to see how high I'm going to want the volcano. But I do want the volcano to be like about up to here. 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 Yeah, I think that'll be good. So it'll be a matter of like trying to get something up here as the output. I do want to try to get the core of the uh the yeah, I want to make this sort of the center because I do want to make the uh the island generator be sort of its like heart. And then what I'm gonna do is just surround just have this surrounded a little bit, but to have this sort of an opening to like kind of get out, but have like lava still spilling around it. Uh, as well, so that's gonna be fun. But I think that's a good base surrounding of what it is that I do want to work on. Uh, I believe someone is. Ye. Oh, wait, no, I picked up... No. I'm mixing them up. Why? Oh, that was a smelter. That's why. Woo. No, 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 no. I do not need a smelter charm. When do you, oh, oh, when do you open uh, your island, or is it going to be locked for the rest of the season? I uh, have a s skeleton quest. Uh, I'll open it again a little bit later. I don't want to do that just, just yet. Uh, I think the plan will be for that to be a little bit later. I see that big ore generator. You, if you get... Uh, ch can you please make a video on how to make one? Oh, uh, actually, I mean, if you see the early... Uh, the, the long live stream, I built this uh, during that. Uh, quite a lot of my videos I've shown kind of me building this. But it's there's actually a really good... Um, there's a very good uh, YouTube video on it as well. But if you want something that's present, um, it is the one from uh, the first, the 13 hour one. But look at more of the earlier, the earlier, the few first few hours um, is where I really already built this out early on. It was like one of the first things that I built uh, for our island because I knew we needed that as soon as possible. Uh, the idea is just that you have you have the platforms uh one two three four five six long one side is just for water so it's actually got a lip and the water just flows down you could have it just flowing straight so long as it's a little bit higher uh but i just never want to have a, a a source water block too close to lava so i i do the little flow method and then the reason why you want this just like you want to be able to see the water is the signs will prevent the water from flowing inside. Like if I break this, the water will flow inside. Um, but if you have a one too high, the bottom row of lava that's right here will turn into obsidian. So you don't want it to flow out. You want it to flow down. Uh, other people, what they've done is instead of the signs, they'll make it go lower and uh, down here. The only reason I don't do it that way is so that uh, from left to right, I can have like that space back and forth. So that I could just look up and farm and go wee um, instead. While if there's a, a gap where I can fall there, 
it'll occasionally just like fall off of it if you don't pay attention and then if you're if you're not focused on it and you have the pickaxe you might just start accidentally destroying your whole um thing and have to repair it and it, it can cause problems so i do that and then i put obsidian here just in case that like if you get out from the straight line uh you might accidentally hit that it's a lot harder to break the obsidian than any of the other uh forms and that's it but yeah uh, all i've done it's it's only it's it's a youtube channel uh, sorry a youtube video of just building a vertical uh cobble gen and um yeah it's the one that i've used since uh and it's been awesome But I love this design. It's the one that I've used cons uh, just consistently. And so long as you have uh, you upgrade your thing with haste and everything, it's going to be amazing. Ooh. I believe that's Thorad. Thorad! Thorad! I'm waiting for Monsieur Thorad to join the voice call. Senor Thorad is in the voice call. Hello. Welcome back, sir. Uh, behind you, there's a weather skeleton. Destroy it. Sounds good. Um, and also... Let's see how much XP these bad boys give me. I believe you need this. 3.2... Oh. Oh. I think these might give me a little more XP. Oh yes, thank you to fix my <laughs> your <Sorry>. noggin. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Gotta fix your noggin. Um, I think there's a spare one in the vault as well that uh, that uh, was left by um, Venom. Cool. Oh wow, there's the money in the vault. vault. I haven't seen that. Yeah, okay, he put the whole set in the vault as well. Cool. Right. The rest of that. I'm but yes. The so we only have the... So the wither's there just for... Uh, at least getting the wither quest out of the way. Uh, the Arnold. one, the 100 gold uh, diamond ore is going to be the pain in the butt, but it'll be doable. I'm already at 70, but I've I've been using the... I've been using the the cobble gen a a lot, so. But at least that'll be useful for us just to get out of the way. Um, as you can see as well, we are at level ninety nine. But you know how much oh, yeah. one wither spawner costs? How oh, much? A billion. Oh, uh, yeah. So that's why we didn't go to a hundred yet, because I was like, nope, wither skeleton more important at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> But one billion, oh boy. How much is it for level 100? I'm curious. You think we'll be able to get it tonight? Level 100 what? On the island? Oh yeah, totally. Hell yeah. I absolutely... Cool see. Absolutely. Um, just the one level is 248. I mean, I could probably sell the robots now and do it. Um, you should try. If, I, if I want to. Uh, oh, okay, maybe not right away. <laughs> I'm trying to. Hey, let me see. What about Condensed Boy? No, not yet. We're gonna wait a little bit. For sure. Uh, they're not. They're not. They. They're not. They haven't marinated long enough for the. Uh, <laughs> for the. For the thing to work out. Um. Yeah. Other than that, uh, it's been. It's been good. Um. As you can see, I added another uh, farmer layer. Nice. And I think at some point we'll be able to add another one later, but that's we've got all five of our farmers there. Um, my farming hoe is at level seventy now with green thumb thirty four. Oh wow! It's, so it's got it's got sixty eight percent replant. So that's gonna be that's I'm trying to get that right now done, and then I think sometime. Uh, later on, I want to try to just figure out how I want to just get the basic layout of the volcano sorted mm -hmm. 
for the uh, for our base and then go from there. Uh, yeah, it'll be interesting to to incorporate because I do think I I want to still keep some of this opening here, but probably encompass the cobble gen a little bit inside. Eh, it'll be interesting. Um, I, I spoke to one of the mods, uh, and I was, I was pointing, I, he came up to the island just to test a bunch of things, so there's, there's like a list of items app apparently sent to like, showcase what's br busted. Uh, one of the things I showed them was the, um, the blaze powder, because I remember, I forgot that uh, the blaze rods was what was dropped before, and not blaze powder. Oh yeah, but I remember the blaze uh, rods were also not being picked up by the um, uh, by the mob hoppers. So uh, I pointed that out. I'm like, that's a bug. They need to fix that. Um, and then I pointed them to the store, and I'm like, yeah. Can you take a look at how much it costs for an iron ingot? And they're like, oh, it's easy. It's uh, it's uh, twenty thousand. I'm like, cool. How much is the iron block? And they're like, ah, oh, it's fifteen thousand. Wait a second. And I'm like, yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> and then we're so we started looking around at the shop, and then it's like, hey, how much is the uh, dark oak sapling? A hundred. What about the acacia sapling? A hundred. What about the jungle sapling? A hundred. What about the birch sapling? A hundred. What about the spruce sapling? Fifth, five hundred thousand. What? Oh, and oak sapling ten thousand. It's like, why? <laughs> why is it so much? So yeah, that that was funny. So uh, it was fun chatting with them uh, on that and uh, just getting a list of stuff that needed to be fixed. Even though it's like super minor and has no like, it's not gonna change anything. Man, does it piss me off when something's just not working well, and it just yeah. it's such a bad bad turn. The selling of it is the same. Like it's it's accurate. Just the buying. I'm like, no one should be spending that much on iron. I'm just saying. Um, once, once green thumb is at a hundred percent and crop drill is at a hundred percent, that means a whole, ch two chunks are going to be able to be farmed in one shot. Oh, shit. And <laughs> right now without a condensed one, each double chest full of nether, nether warts, at least for me, sells for about a million. Once we could condense it, it would be more than that. Probably near 10 times. Um, but that's going to be crazy. Where that's going to be a very like grind-worthy uh, direction to kind of move things forward. We're really uh, going to have to get these uh, oh, come on. soon. Uh, I keep getting level ups that are not green thumb. And I'm like, no, I want green thumb. I don't want to keep putting back the warts that I remove. Although it's a lot faster now, uh, as of lately, with my uh, recent tool. Is there any way you could pick up the netherite grinder so I could farm the blaze for a bit? Uh, I should be able to. Uh, oh, wait. Should I sell them? Oh, yeah, I totally should. Uh, I'll sell them at least just the normal way. Boop. Yeah, okay. I wanted uh, $12 million. Nice. Boop. There, I'll put them in the, uh, in the, in the barrel. Good night. Oh, it's you, actually. You already have it. No, we're good. What? The, the robot's with you. Because oh. you had placed it before. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, if if you shift and use your wand, cell wand, you can gain levels on it. Don't. They're fixing it. But yeah, I, when we were looking into bugs as well, I saw that one. I'm like, that's that's dumb. <laughs> yeah, what? Does it even give you options for enchants or? 
I, I didn't go further than that. <laughs> uh, there's no point. <laughs> how, no, but think how bad it would be if it was the, if it's a non-infinite wand and it breaks after you use oh, it. Geez. I use the limit of it. Man, look at my perfect, like, cell wand. It's great. It's convenient. Oh, wait, it broke because I used it all. Uh-oh. Like, nah, it's insane. Imagine. Yeah. Uh, so, the only thing I need to try to figure out, so, uh, for sure, getting Green Thumb and Nether Warts is the way to go to level up the Farming Hoe. Um, the... I'm half... I still think you might want to start with another sword. If Souls 1 is still the one that you're, you, you have. Because I think you're just, you just got super unlucky and did not get... Like, there's no way you... Uh, it just seems like you got really unlucky with that. I definitely did. Because, like, at least if you can get more more than one soul... My my freaking axe in the barrel has more souls than your sword. <laughs> and I didn't even try. Like, I just put souls because, like, eh, whatever. So, I think there's... I'm down to try. Yeah, I think it'd be worth it. Especially the new grinder sword you just got from the kit I gave you. I think it'd be better. Uh, we still need a freaking collection box. Gosh darn it. Frazzle dazzle. <laughs> uh, but no, it, it's, it's annoying that we don't have one. Cause just, well, actually we're gonna need more than one, but Getting a collection box is going to be a big deal for us. Uh, getting things moving forward. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, on a side note, how was your day at work? It was good. A little busy. This is not bad, at least when it gets the day done. It feels like it gets yeah, the day done faster. Yeah, that's the one thing I like about it. The day, like, definitely goes five times. Yeah, like, I, I was the same thing. Like, like, especially, like, when you get into the office at, like, eight in the morning, you drink your coffee, you get everything started, you get the whole team going, and then you, you just, like, turn around, and it's like, what do you mean it's lunchtime? <laughs> it's just like, that's yeah. insane. Or people like just going like, ah, it's break time. I'm like, no, it's not. And I look and it's like, wow, oh, it is 10.30. What the heck? Uh, <laughs> yeah, it's not. Uh, yeah, the days that it's slow, I'm literally just like sitting there staring at the wall. Yeah. I hated. Yeah, I hate. I hate it when things are slow. Then you're like, oh, what do I? Uh, what do I do? Um, easy, even as a manager, when, uh, when I was... Uh, if it was ever, if I was ever on a project that was constantly slow, um, I would, I would test alongside my, my team just because of just like, I miss testing, but I also like loved just like finding issues and be like, yo guys, has anybody seen this? I haven't seen, I haven't vetted this. And they're like, oh, that's an issue. And it's like, what do you mean? It's not an issue. <laughs> Oh, I didn't know we could uh, report stuff like that. Please do now. <laughs> uh, I remember, like, oh, I remember one of our projects. Uh, one of the projects that I had, none of the support team, uh, none of the uh, administrative team uh, members had a chance to even touch the game because there's so many reports we had to. We had a very particular client that needed like. It wasn't just the reports that we needed done, but we were using their proprietary um, gaming system to analyze the game, and the game was an open world game. So anytime there was an issue, the system was integrated so that you would push a button 
it would create, uh, it would not only start the bug report, but it would pull all the information of that location and it would tie into any of the issues that would come up um, already reported maybe in that area. So like there was already a way to like check if there's a, a bug report already done about it at a like cursory uh, like look without even searching the database itself. Uh, so that was crazy. Um, but then what was crazier is that it would upload all of the information of your game, like your game data, like which missions you completed, um, what things did you do up to that point, uh, from what direction you went to, what location you're at at that place. It kind of like Google mapped the, the, the things in game as well. Oh, it was, it was an amazing but insane thing to set up and get done. And then you have to learn how to, like, use the hotkeys and, and while you're trying to, to, to do that. Because, like, it was an open world. Like, there's no way you couldn't... Like, we had issues in the past uh, where you had developers going, Oh, we can't reproduce it. Even though we've written and we've written the bug as, like, as clear as day. They just don't follow the the bug steps, and so they're like, "Oh, we can't reproduce it." So we think it's not there. Um, until later, we started showing them videos and being able to upload videos and send those. And then, like developers are like, "Oh, well, we need more of those." And then um, the technology of how things were reported got better and better. But this is the first time we had one where everything was being tracked to the that point. Um, and it was insane. Or I, I at least found it insane. Um, but definitely bug, uh, <laughs> bug reporting. Uh, bug reporting in general got crazy when we had to like... Because uh, it, it, it was a pain in the butt when, like, uh, when a uh, dev would be like, uh, could you send a video of your tester uh, doing the thing? It's like, why? Because you don't believe us or because you, like, can't do it because you suck? Um, <laughs> but that that's actually what was interesting is that, like, you have developers that are really good at coding, no squat about testing or gaming. Uh, like, actually playing the game. So that part, I thought, was really funny. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, that's... That, that was fun. But that, that game was so weird to, like handle everything that was going on because it was like uh we need to report these things and like trigger the mechanics of it to be able to set, upload it to the database to, oh it was, it was nuts my battle pen. have you been looking at yours uh ooh, yeah i think i hope mine change there's a lot of them that need to be changed too in my opinion that they don't know about think that are oh 50 coins in, i forgot about that yeah i think they're just in like random rotation or something uh oh i did get the daily challenge uh credits from selling yes there's uh, collect 109 shards on it yeah Kill i just got one that's enchant 42 levels on your weapons tools and armor but yes the, um, the new enchants don't count for that yeah, yeah yeah that's actually another one of the issues that was uh that was brought up with the guy that I was uh, chatting with today, okay. uh, to get that uh, uh, to get that fixed. So yeah, they're aware. Mm. At least the the person that I was working with uh, to find these bugs uh, is aware of it. <laughs> Your oh, yeah. island has reached tier six for blazes. Let's go! Wait, that's max master for for blazes. 2.5 cell multiply here. Yeah. It's definitely loud near you. That's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, bouncer, 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 bouncer. <laughs> um, are you using a new sword or an old sword? New sword. Okay. It does uh, definitely lose Dara a lot faster, though. Remember how mine got like five unbreaking enchants? Yeah, true. 
I mean, it's not a big deal. I just think it's funny. <laughs> like, how much of a difference does break? Oh, the sharpness of my axe suck, though. But I have Souls 2 on it. I think that grinder is in the... What? Uh, I think the grinder robot is killing the wither skeleton. Oh, I totally know it is. But we need it for master. Yeah, I just push him away. Well, I mean, you, you have it. You completed it already, right? Uh, I don't think so. Okay, well... I moved him away so that he'll be able to stack now. Okay. So we should be good. That's all you need to do is just you just push him and you're good then. Uh, four, six, nine. Okay, well, we'll be good with the sword for now. Uh, next dungeon when is? Oh, next dungeon's in an hour. Okay. Sadly, I was eating during the last one. Otherwise, I would have done. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, speaking of eating, I'm like, I still have my sandwich beside me. I'm good. <laughs> um, yeah, I was gonna, like, I wanted to make supper, but, like, we we just had so much stuff happening today. Uh, Mort was actually the one that was supposed to do a stream today. Uh, but they ended up having a lot of stuff to get done as well. So, I was like, fine, but I need, like, I'm gonna go rest. Because I'm like, I'm tired. I've been non-stop uh, doing stuff as well. And I was like, yeah, still going to still gonna do a stream. And now it's almost been two hours. Woo! Uh, everyone everyone who wants to show some love, put some heart emojis in the ch YouTube chat. Woo! Heart emoji. Um, yeah. And yeah, everyone uh, who's in chat. Yeah! Thank you! Woo! <laughs> uh, but don't hesitate if you've got questions, if you're curious about stuff. Oh, uh, there you go. Thorin used one of the, the <laughs> one of the uh, <laughs> unique emojis. I love it. Um, I gotta actually check. I uh, I don't know if it's five, if I need five or if it's three members uh, that I can add new uh, more emojis because I have a few of them pending uh, to add as well. So I'm gonna have to look into that after the stream uh, right. or before the next stream. For, uh, for people to have access to that when you become a denizen. Woo! Uh, but as as usual, you don't have to be a denizen. That's just like if you really can. Uh, but if you are able to at least subscribe or, and like, uh, uh, and just the fact that you watched any of the ads just to get into uh, with the stream, those are very much appreciated. So thank you very much, everyone. Do, 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 do. Okay, um... Shuffle Master, don't swear. That's bad. <laughs> Sh Shovel Master sounds like a D-rated DC villain. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> I will say that Arkham Asylum... Arca I think it was Arkham Asylum? Made freaking Calendar Man an impressive <laughs> character, so go figure. Oh, nice. You got a level on um on my hoe yeah uh green thumb yes 70 uh i'll play on the server as soon as it updates to the new bedrock because oh bedrock just updated yeah yeah they're gonna be that's a bit of a delay uh no wait did it just just happen because we have or i did see members yeah, yeah, there's Bedrock players now. Interesting. Kevin Council's on there now. I'm on the server. Like, yeah, Kevin Council's a Bedrock player. He's always been a Bedrock player. So I guess it depends on who? But okay. 
I, I know that that tends to be a thing, then they do update it, but it can sometimes be delayed. But I'm surprised some of the members... Uh, Bedrock players are on if that's the thing because I, I am aware of that Also, I stuff to check if I could I keep not being able to find out how to get my bedrock version Oh, Ooh. it's because it's on the switch. That's why got it Got it. I understand now Switch it's Nintendo. That's the problem Uh, they haven't pushed the uh, they haven't pushed the update uh, live. Man, the amount of times we've had issues testing, and it's because of the publisher. Uh, sorry, uh, because it's uh, the console, the console people not pushing the thing pro out properly, and it's like, uh, excuse me, please do your job. We need the thing to do the thing, otherwise you don't get the things. You know. <laughs> um. Yeah, because I know Ka Kevin Council plays on his phone or tablet. Tablet? I think it was a tablet, but still uses a controller. I love it. It's funny. What a setup! <laughs> I love it. What a savage! <laughs> and he does really well in dungeons. So go figure. Like I mean, he does. Uh, like anyone who says that Bedrock players don't have a chance. Oh, it is phone. He confirmed it. Um. Yeah, so like, that's that's pretty impressive. Like you can play on the server and you like from your phone. Uh, that's that's baller if anything. It just shows that there's like opportunities for anyone to play on the server. I think I really I I don't know. I like, Minecraft's just fun that way, and I like that Java servers have been able to include Bedrock. Uh, but I mean, part of it also is the fact that, um. It's Mojang who have set it up so that it can be done as well. Uh, I remember when Minecraft was on the phone, it was just Pocket Edition, and all you could do is like creative and survival. But yep. now you can like join all the servers and stuff. Cool. And like, uh, yeah, I remember actually the what made me start where I started playing Minecraft is actually on the uh, the 360 version. Nice. On uh, well, the Xbox 360. <laughs> And I was just playing on that, and they have a limited world, so like the world is as big as a uh, as a big as a big uh, map, and that's it. You couldn't go further than that. So I ended up building like this roller coaster all around the map, um, right. to the extent uh, of it, and then just like built a little bit of things inside, and then that was it. Like there's not much else i did with that but uh, i eventually was like yeah it's like what java could do much more than that oh man i'm totally playing java and just never stopped since True. yeah java is definitely the way to go they always get updates first first and stuff but but i, I do so viable if you like don't have any other i do look forward to seeing um I do look forward to seeing things to being standardized. I think that'd be nice. Uh, because two versions is weird. Um, with that said, um, I definitely need to figure out the Bedrock thing. Because I absolutely want to try out the Mega Man X uh, version that they released uh, for Bedrock. Uh, like little patch mod thing. Uh, it looks awesome. They recreated Meg the Mega Man, uh, some of the Mega Man X stages, but in Minecraft. So I'm like, I want to play so bad. I like me, my Me I like my Mega Mans. <laughs> Give me my Mega Mans. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, I just gotta wait till it grows again. Come on, come on, grow faster. I need to level up my things. I'll just do this side. Uh, yeah, it is slowly now becoming slower to uh, uh, to level up the the farming hoe, but because of I keep getting green thumb most of the time, 
it's taking less time to put it back together. So it is much more viable. It's a lot faster to get moving forward. Yeah. Uh, random question, Thorad. Mm -hmm. If you could buy a brand new computer, what kind of computer would you get? A Intel computer or an AMD computer? Personally, probably AMD because that's what I have right now. But that's literally the only reason. So <laughs> I'm not the best person to ask for that. Okay. Fair. So what made you get an AMD in the first place rather than a uh, Intel? That's what my friend recommended. Yeah. Oh, well, yeah, because uh, at the time, AMD was, like, powerful and cheap. Um, it's got some hiccups here and there, but it is still pretty darn good. Um, I think I would stick... I will say... Okay, I will say the, uh, the, the latest generation... Um, the latest generation, uh, either or is good. They, what was great though, is that AMD lowered, the, lowered their price. Uh, and so did Intel right after on the high, on their high end stuff. So the prices of like, they're mutually good, uh, for either one that you would use. Um, I think some of the limitations is I think a, like some of them don't have, uh, DDR5 yet. Uh, yeah. aspect of things so the latest memory chipset uh, availability stuff but aside from that it's like they're basically it's back on tr it's back on track for them to be like neck and neck on how good they are so it's like whichever you're more comfortable with is going to be the better one uh sure. to go with um and you're just gonna be able to do like so much with it moving forward um man i'd love a new computer right now actually um mostly mostly f so funny enough mostly the reasons why i would want it though is for like editing purposes but i hate editing i'd rather just get an editor um uh, but like i don't have the money for it right now uh but yeah i i was actually talking to someone today and uh because they were like they, they were sort of showing interest in like maybe streaming and stuff like that so i was like trying to like gauge on like what 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 they could do what they needed stuff like that and they're like <laughs> one of the things that came up and they're, they're like oh yeah i have money and i'm like oh okay well if he, if i was in your situation this is what i would do and it was just funny trying to like outline a possibility of like getting a streamer up and running when you have money to like invest in yourself that like the right kind of money to invest in yourself and one of the things mm -hmm. i told them immediately is just like get yourself an editor like right off the bat if you can get and actually it might actually be a better a better thing to do is that like if you can afford if you can get a you can, if you can get and afford an editor to do um like you make an agreement between like what the rate is and all that stuff that can get you to make videos out of your vlogs make shorts out of your vlogs and publish and be able to also do your streams from your channel uh that's a good way to start things for your for any channel because eventually you can get what you could do what's good is that that editor a it'll give them practice but b they can because they're developing sort of your image from the beginning they'll be able to do they'll be able to set kind of how the videos will work from the get-go type of thing yeah and that's going to end up being the uh the direction where things can move forward uh for someone's channel that is brand new um and what what recommendations would you give when starting skyblock on mc hub uh okay uh vote <laughs> uh definitely um definitely vote uh at some point you will get a lot of shards from voting 
uh, but you'll also be getting uh, vote tokens that that accumulate. Uh, you you don't have to spend it immediately, but if you wanted to, you could get additional keys uh, to help you get things moving forward. But I would say you could hold on to them for potential later on items like premium currency, which you can end up using on the coin shop and get things like uh, other crates or even ranks. Uh, if you sync up your account to the MC Hub Discord channel, uh, you can get a free rank of Epic. Aside from that, if you're able to, if you're able to um, gain enough shards, even just from the pouches that you get, check out the um, miscellaneous or just do all. And you'll see that there's a lot of people that sell uh, Mystic Ranks for like 14,000 shards. And it's a lot when you, you, don't, you don't accumulate them quickly. But most of the time, like the amount that I have right now, which is 24,000, was just from pouches. Uh, and that's just from voting that I got those and just the vote parties coming in. Um, so that will be an easy way. And Mystic Rank gets you flying. That's the only thing that I would say that would be really important is getting at least a Mystic Rank so you could start flying and it'll help you a lot more with the building. Otherwise, first things first is just going in order of all of the um, the crop masteries that you need to do. You'll have to start with wheat. Once you get at least tier one of wheat, you'll be able to unlock beetroot. Beetroot's the worst one, but I still hate beetroot over any of the other ones. Uh, the beetroot, carrots, potatoes, uh, melon and pumpkins is going to take a little bit longer just because of how they grow. But get a good axe just to get rid of them quickly and you'll be good. Or if you've somehow leveled up a, a farming hoe um, and has a long enough crop drill, it can like get through them really quickly. But axe would go through these a lot faster. When pumpkin, uh, the only thing that's good is if you like had crop drill. <laughs> so like now... It's just taking forever for Pumpkin to get away because of the Getting up. replant yeah. is actually working effectively. Yay, cool. How many okay. did I get? Oh, I dropped a bunch. No. Why? Oh, this will be funny too. It's actually going to go into the carrots a bit. But yeah. Uh... Oh, no. It just missed the carrots. Cool. Oh, yeah, because it's a full chunk. That's good. Um, so yeah, there's that to, uh, uh, to work on. Otherwise, there's other things as well. Get yourself farmer robots and really? start getting them, uh, working for you. This will be a good way to get money. Uh, one thing, uh, and I've said it before, but since you're here and you're asking directly, do not go past emerald farmers. Uh, make sure you stack them up in the, the different layers. You need these repaired, don't you? Yeah, give me. Fix all. That's a bad three. 368. Ooh. Thank you. Um, but you get start your layers of it. And uh, I mentioned it before, but the you'll have a robot limit, but that's per type of robot. So we can put up to five grinder robots. We can put up to five farmer robots. Uh, when you start out, you're going to be able to put two. Uh, but if you have two of them, put them up, have them work. Uh, they can work in a one chunk area. We just have it in a four chunk area here. Uh, because eventually turning this into a bedrock and then a netherite robot will eventually, they'll be able to build this. So this is like their last home. Uh, but earlier we had them underneath here and just working on any of the type of crops. And you can tell uh, we had them before because we had like a little spot missing there type of thing. Uh, ugh, I don't even want to fix the beat root. Um, but eventually you want to lead yourself to uh, getting to netherite because netherite will get you the max amount, like the highest amount of money uh, from farming. And then getting that to the max tiers is going to help you a lot. So that's going to be good for farming. For cobblestone, uh, gens, yeah, I definitely look to build something like this. Uh, all of these are individual lava sources. So you will have to go one layer at a time. If you have the shard, like loads of shards, 
Uh, you can go to S Shop and buy it. Go to uh, Miscellaneous, and you can buy an infinite lava bucket, or and it's going to be a lot of buckets. You can go to a, a expensive, which is not really expensive. Each bucket is a hundred dollars. It stacks up, but you can just do one row first and like slowly work up the the other ones. I think I did it up to three until I upgraded our pickaxe um, to a, a a solid level, and then it went. We went uh, further than that. Uh. Yeah. Uh, what else? Yeah, and then same thing for mob, uh, mob uh, spawners. Uh, work on them slowly. What I would suggest, though, is you don't have to start from the lowest to the highest for the tiers. You can go directly to like sheeps, and that's what we did. And just because we know that later on, we're gonna look to probably do a drop farm with the sheeps. So instead of wasting money on a panda, which we don't want we might buy the cow and pigs later on but we know for for a fact we're going to use the sheeps um and they tend to be roughly uh like the same amount actually are they the same amount as the yeah the same amount as the uh so the cow is the same amount as the, the sheep and the pigs just a little bit lower and then the pandas a million uh i just hate killing pandas the sound that they make is horrid um, so, you know. And, yeah. Just slowly build on the mastery of it. But if you're gonna have to kill of each tier, and only the tier, so it could be one of the four mobs that are in uh, level one, you need to kill 100, uh, sorry, 15,000 of them to, re to have access to level two ones. And then same thing, once you, you have that, buy buy one of the ones here, go to the uh, the next one as well. I would suggest getting skeletons in this case, because skeletons are needed for one of the quests that you have access to. And that's the other thing you should look into doing as well, is just work on getting the quests started. Uh, first one's just getting cobblestone out of the way. That's easy, you can literally buy it and just mine it a bunch of times. Um, but this will immediately get you a minor robot in a small pouch, then just harvesting enough wheat, that'll get you immediately your iron farmer. So getting the quest completed will get you moving forward, uh, at a starting point, uh, and getting uh, a lot of the starting robots from there. So that's another, that's another thing to work on. There's just, there's a lot of direction to go into to start, but yeah, be aware of the mastery system. Um, on getting the farmings uh, moving one at a time, but definitely work on the quest. Make sure you vote, um, and those are gonna get you the resources you need to really get moving forward. And yeah, I think that's a good round thing to do. I will try to update uh, a more rec a more updated version video, at least to encompass the enchantments. Uh, but I think the last video that I have kind of giving a breakdown of everything you can do is still mostly valid. Just the enchantment parts are really the, um, the big, uh, the big difference that's happening, uh, this season. Uh, crop drill. Seem to be having more difficulty trying to get green thumb. But yeah, if you have any, I hope that helps. If there's any other questions, though, uh, don't hesitate to let me know. Thread. I mean, he can answer too if he wants. <laughs> totally up to him, though.
If this third level doesn't give me souls, I'm gonna be sad. Oh, it's still how gosh. Okay. That's the thing and we I, I wanna try I, I there's gonna be a it's the one of the more difficult ways to do things is level up the um level up the sword to be effective. It's just really good because it's already got like sharpness fifteen. But then trying to like level it up. It seems it's easier to level up a freaking axe right now than it is a uh, sword. With what, though? Uh, pumpkins. I thought that got nerfed like crazy. So axes still get one per uh, one uh, one experience from uh, cocoa beans, melons, pumpkins. Um, not ten. But, like, you still have to run around and, like, destroy them over and over and over again, so. Uh... Oh, for those that are, like, trying to get an early uh, uh, farming hoe, uh, you get it, you get one for free from your, um, from a regular member's kit for free. So make sure you do slash kits. Slash kits. There we go. Spell it correctly. This, if you select this, it's available every thirty minutes, but you do get a free, um, a free diamond hoe uh, from that. It'll be called a member's hoe. What you can also just do is just use diamond and build it yourself, and that's what I ended up doing. And I just don't have my hoe called the member's hoe. I don't know. It was a little thing. I just didn't want to have it named. Um, theoretically, you could get, I think, other tools leveled up as well, but you might as well just get it, get a diamond one done. Um, uh, when, when using it for farming, it's going to be fine. It's more when you're going, like when you till, when you till the ground is when you'll lose the durability. And the last thing you want is like, you've leveled up somehow a wooden Ho to like the max level, but then you lost it because you tilled it five times. Like, so just be very mindful of those type of things. Because I think the only way that you lose durability is either when you till uh, till dirt or when you remove leaves using it uh, with a hoe. Uh -huh. Uh, we still have to, uh, gotta, yeah, so I really gotta figure out how, I wanna, so the way that I wanna design the, the volcano is to have the volcano as if it's like, uh, it's holding, it's able to hold, uh, sort of like a crystal skull, but I wanna make the, the skull... I want to make, I want to build a skull out of bone, uh, like blown bone blocks. So that part I, I'm I'm totally fine with. Uh, but what I want to do is I want to put uh, red glass above it, on top of it. Um, and then like shape, put put specific items, uh, like in its like eye sockets inside its eye sockets or something, to make like its eyes glow. But to make it look like it's a glowing red though. So I've got a. I think I have an idea of how I'm gonna do that, but I think the skull is gonna be pretty big. Um, but I want the skull to be um, balanced on like spikes at the top of the volcano, and then the volcano just has the lava running out uh, off of the beside the spikes. So I have an idea of how I want to build it. I just don't know how. <laughs> uh, it's level four, no souls yet. Uh, all right, leave it for now. I'll, I'll, I'll take a look at it on another sword later. I don't, I don't want you to not like have shards. Mind you, I've got loads of it right now. 
I mean, I have 25k, I've been saving yeah, up too, okay. and I haven't spent them, so. I've got 23k. But the way that I see it with my sword that I have now, so I got all those other ones out of the way, I'm actually gonna have a chance to get a lot of souls now. Hopefully. Hopefully. <laughs> okay, you know what? Let's go around and sell the, uh... Try making it in creative world. Oh yeah, I totally, I totally could figure. Like I, I'm definitely someone who could, uh, who could go to creative and figure it out. Uh, but I also like that it's fun that I'm just kind of figuring it out on my own, in, uh, on the server as well. And since there's enough of sort of a creative-ish ability, like I could just go shopping and buy what I need to buy. Uh, so like here's the red stained glass. I know I'm gonna put that over. Um, bone. I can use quartz. Quartz might be another one I, I might use, but I'm more interested in maybe using, mm -hmm. uh, I think it's, I forget which one I have to use. Is it bone or bone meal that I have to? Yeah. Okay. So it's bone meal. So uh, I could just make bones out of these. Uh, so I need the bones to become bone meal. Get enough of the bone meal, uh, blocks to make bone blocks. And eventually get to uh, enough of the... Uh, get enough of them to make a skull. I do like the, t the tint of it is enough to actually make it look like... It's the right color that needs to be there. Uh, yee. Cool. 28. No. I have 49 blocks, that's fine. Uh, I've got a skeleton spawner, so I'll be able to get more bones for sure, so that won't be a problem. Uh, yee. So, more than enough. Although you drop no bones, you drop cast tears for some reason. Uh, but yeah, I have a general idea. That's why, like, I have the shape going. The volcano's gonna sort of start here, and I'll have, like, a little lippy lip thing going on here. Uh, I do want to have like this sort of opened up uh, and move so that there's a bit of an opening. Oh, maybe I could do it. Oh, maybe I could do the opening from like this side. Because I could break this. Yeah, I could break this side a little bit more to have access more on that side. Yeah, I could do that. That could work. Um, That could work a little bit better. And then just have this sort of built a little bit more roundish to have a, uh, a cave design more so that, and then we can build internally uh, more of a, like a, a, a facilitated base. Uh, but instead, this is more or less still the island, the, the starting island, but we cleared this area. We had this as a temporary farm. Um, and then I removed the tree um, and just slowly cleared this out. I'll be removing these guys as well, which I could do right now, but I'll leave them for now. Although you know I don't like NPCs on my island. I'll put them in cages later. It'll be fun. Uh, <laughs> air quotes, fun. Uh, <laughs> uh ye. So that'll be the idea that I've got, but I really want to... Uh, 73. I really want to get the... Oh yeah, what? no, 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 no. I said I was gonna sell. That's what I wanna do right now. Uh, but before I sell, I need to condense everything. So, you give me the condensed charm, fall down the hole. Uh, note again, for, for those that see me doing this, only the owner of the island can remove and put charms in um, so you could, other members can put charms in, but they won't be able to remove them. So just be aware of that. Uh, yeah, no, we remove the other grinder robots. So we'll just put you in just because of the cobblestone, even though that's not much. I'd rather do it than not at all. Cool. So you put that back. Uh, we were lucky enough to win the condenser charm from the dungeon. 
Uh, that's why we th we're uh, speaking of dungeon. Next done. Uh, 14 minutes. Nice. So yeah, I think I'm going to be joining that as well. So, Hey, let's go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, because we can get... If we can find enough of stuff from there, it's going to be very useful. Cool. If we can find another infinite condense, that would be insane. Yes, absolutely. But what I'd like more... Well, I, at the very least, we could use that to trade for something. Um... Okay, uh, no. I'm gonna use the two times multiplier. Yeah, 70 million, 70 million, 70 million, 70 million, 70 million. Uh, cactuses I know are max, so. that enough to go to a hundred i think that might but i'm gonna go to the hub the reason i go to the hub is to reset the uh the booster do you know why they don't let you join server on the latest minecraft version uh well they need to update the server that's the problem if the update has just happened for uh, bedrock that's the that's the issue um, so they will, they, it's something that, uh, if it's not, if you, if you or someone else isn't already notified people on the, uh, on the server, then what needs to be done is that, um, basically the server needs to be updated and usually they do update pretty quickly for bedrock. And then for situations like people that are on different platforms, like the switch or, uh, a different uh, type those need to be updated as well on their platforms um but certain people right now are still able to access it but i think it's like from i think the phone version still works right now um but the switch one doesn't seem to be so it's a little bit uh up in the air at the moment but it will be updated it should generally be updated soon and that should hopefully uh let people get back on track with their uh with with updating stuff oh you were able to go back to the ba the last mc version okay yeah some people can't do that uh so that's that's something that could be a limit to them uh oh yeah totally there nice What do you mean, don't repeat the same message? When's the last time I wrote a message? Did, was my last message a smile? What? Okay, well, whatever. Don't let me smile. Fine, that's fine. Uh, what did that actually level me up to? Uh, they gave us a, uh, the next tier. Good. Power multiplier, great. Spawner speed, a little bit faster. Good. Oh, crop cell multiplier goes up. Yes. Crop growth goes up. Good. Redstone limit, whatever. Uh, I don't do much redstone. Uh, except for, like, when I need to do the clocks for, uh, bamboo and, um, and kelp. Uh, and island size is bigger now. Cool. Neat. Ten more minutes. So yeah, we're going to do some dungeon. That'll be a little bit more fun. Oh, we're back at number seven. Woo! I stop number seven. <laughs> I like that if if you're the next... Pro oh, yeah. Because Nitro Pop was already there and apparently it pushed them down. Yeah, we got it. We got our number seven spot back. Woo! 
Uh, that's fine. <laughs> that's just that's just funny. Uh, ooh, I'm gonna stop. I would like to stay in the top ten. That would make me happy. I think we will. I think we're I doing think so well. Too. As long as we keep up what we've been doing, we'll be, I think, good. Yeah, and a lot of what we've been doing has been very free to play. Like we, all, like okay, I will admit that uh, stuff that we have has been from us playing MC Hub for a while. So like our, our grinder kits are ours from a while ago. Uh, ranks are kept uh, between seasons. So anybody who gets like a Mystic rank or higher, it's kept between seasons. So next season, if you got a Mystic rank last season, you'll keep it for the for the next one. Um, so that's gonna be like it's an investment sort of thing. Um, but besides those usual notes, it's just because we know the server well enough, but it's not like I haven't showcased everything either through streaming or through the many videos that have been released on my channel. So... Eh? Um, but this season's very... This season's been good because, like, I've seen I've seen the other islands and like the they're they're it they're at level they're at crazy uh, setups right now, but it's still slowing them down because they're still limited by like what kind of tools they can get, what kind of gear they can get, and a lot of the pl players that are playing up there are actually not uh, they're not spending so much money either. Um, so you can and there's not and truth be told. I don't think there's a problem with that, but it, MC Hub is designed that it is not as fortunate to uh, to like you don't gain um, an unfair advantage uh, to such a, to, to a ridiculous degree. Um, I will say that like some of the items that they have produced can seem unfair but I wouldn't say it's the worst um yeah I think we were discussing it before but like sell one multiplier but we were even looking into that right now I have currently one of uh, one of the skin sets that give you multipliers uh as well and it's one of the higher ones it's the reason why I'm selling I'm also one of the higher ranks on our team. Also a reason why I'm selling. Um, so it's stuff like that that's helped with the uh, uh, with us. But it's not like we're, we're we don't gain that much more than that. Uh, in 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 the bigger scheme of things, so you could still gain gain just as much on what you're getting on like on your own as well. Uh, but do check skins. And, like, right now, yeah, we have the Sinful set. Uh, but, like, there's other ones. Even the blower ones get a sub-multiplier of, like, 0 0.1. And, like, mid ones do 0 0.5. For the longest time, I, I was using the Ender set. Until I got, uh... Whoa, Ancient Blood doesn't... What is Ancient Blood? I think that's a skin set that they're trying to set up. Uh, then more Sinful set. And then you have other ones as well. Uh, so lunar, a uh, lunar set helps Thor mastery, um, pilgrim has set, and these are all limited edition ones from the events that they've had before. And you can see that they don't do sell a multiplier. Uh, they just do specifically for the mastery. Um, and the mastery is just, okay. You mastered it faster. Once you have it done, you're done. So it's not that big of a deal, uh, overall. At least I don't think it is. It might be for some people. Uh, but, yeah. Nope. Because I'm going to have to start filling up the holes. And I don't want to do that just yet. So, let's put that away. Uh, let's put you away. Uh, I guess I'll take this plain sword uh shop buy some apples i guess 
I don't use these, but I'll bring them with me. Do you need more shiny apples? Thorad. Hello? Buddy? You there? Yo, sorry. Uh, do you need more goldy apples? Um, okay, thank you. I have 27 enchanted apples. Okay, so we're good on the edge. Just put that there. So I think we're going to be good for that. Uh, dungeon is in four minutes. So yeah. Um, what else can I show? Um, a lot of what we do is very, like, reminiscent to what we've done before. So we are, we're very familiar with where to go. Uh, with it. So that part's been, like, some people might find that boring. And it could, and I can understand that that could be boring for people. Um, but that's, that's also, uh... No, Thor, that's fine. <laughs> um, so, what's what's been happening as well is that um, there's just, okay, so there's a lot of similar things still going on and kind of following the same path, but getting there is a lot harder, like getting the soul sword. We used to get that done in like one day. We're still not even at a soul 100. Same thing for getting an enchantment tool. That would usually take us a little bit longer, but we would have one ready by now. We're still not even close. Uh, some people are well ahead of that, but like, th let me tell you, the top islands right now, they are grinding non-stop. We are playing very casually. Like, we're actively casual, I would say. I'd say more active, but we're not like non-stop level like the, the top players. And with that, we're still on IS top, number seven, number eight, and we're basically gonna probably be floating around uh, the like the bottom range. I think it's gonna be a little bit harder to get higher than that, uh, but we'll see where we go from there. But yeah, just the fact that like the team members here are all very close to the same. Uh, the same ranks and stuff is showing just how much the there's like that similarity of how to get there as well. So, uh, yeah, and you can see like people's monies are very similar to what we're getting as well. No one's like gone crazy or gone like well ahead, uh, too far if they haven't spent it. Like, he, Am I on a different part of Skyblock? Says Bem Bem is number seven. You might be. Uh, you might be on the wrong Skyblock. Actually, did they, did they break the thing? Oh, I've, I've. Did they break the thing again like last time? Let me see. Ye they have okay um don't don't use the person so is top here actually this is funny yeah 500 uh yeah so this is where this is things are broken uh yeah exactly uh go back to hub when you're back in the hub highlight the server selector and then select Skyblock Sun. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to let someone know about that. That's a problem. They keep forgetting to update that. What do you mean he... Oh, did he just leave?
No, not a problem. Have fun, Thread. Uh, or I'm just not. Maybe, uh... So Thorad's out for the night. And that's fine. I will try to go to dungeons right now. That Jun right now. Uh, already in. Ow! Oh, you sneaky monster! So yeah, you can see just by the first mob, I already got a shard pouch. How much did that give me? Fifty nine. Was that a lot? No, but it's better than nothing. So what I'm gonna do is start trying to look around. Oh, I'm already in an area where there's potential uh, chests. Uh, is there any of them? None of these are opening right now. So I might be. It might not be worth staying yet. Uh, I'm gonna eat an apple though. I'm going to walk away. So 18, 17. And I think the other one was a uh, 16 minute. So it might be worth going somewhere else at the moment. Uh, 16. Uh, 19. 18. Already getting mobbed by a lot of the people. What rank do you donor think is the most valuable? Uh, My Mythic rank is the best one to get. It's where you get the... So, Mythic rank is the one you get for flying. Afterwards, uh, Legend is probably the better one for uh, fixing armor pe pieces. Is uh, your best bet at that point. So, uh, my so Mythic rank at least... I would say I suggest you getting it just for the fly mode. And then uh, once you at least get that, the next one to eventually get would be uh, to, to get to, uh, to Legend at least. Come on. Jump. 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 Uh, which direction do I want to go? Uh, I'll probably get myself killed and make my way there again. So let's look around. Ow. 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 Oh yeah, this is going to give me a lot of fuel too. Ah, uh, it's going to be fun. Uh, yeah. It goofed up the stats a little bit, but that's fine. Uh, yes, yeah, so that's over there. Still waiting on that. It's fine. Uh, lots of players over there. So they're on their way here. Let's go check over there. Uh, of course. Uh, the... Upgrading, I need to upgrade my pants to prevent me from getting pushed so often by the, uh, uh, the little flyer guy. Uh. Ow. Uh. Ooh, dungeon loot. When are you available? You're in... Three minutes. Okay. This is good. Ow. You're a little put whoa. I didn't you could climb up to here? Oh, that's I did not know that. That's new. Or at least I'm that's new to me. Cool. I'm going to wait for that to happen, because that's good. Um Oh, that's eight minutes. No, that's three minutes. Okay, I can wait the three minutes. That three minutes is worth the wait. 
but yeah, Mythic Rank for sure. Uh, I mentioned it before. If you go to the auction house, there's people that are selling it for about 17,000 shards, and that's pretty cheap. Um, then Overlord, someone's like selling it for like 660, 70, 80, 90. They're expensive. Once you can get um, at least a mythical rank, you're in better. I think you're in decent shape um, to move forward. Uh, just the flying part's going to help you a lot. So get that for the flying. It'll help you. Um, and then once you have the flying done, make your way to um, uh, getting legend at least. Anything higher than that is going to be nice to have. Um, the reason why I say nice to have is just because you're going to have... Uh, the more high, the higher your rank, the easier and cheaper your your fixes are going to be. Uh, okay, there's a locked chest over there as well. I think that's one that I passed. That was too long ago. Uh, that, that was going to be taking too much time. Uh, but yeah. So the idea is that the higher the rank is uh, in the whole chart, the, the cheaper they're going to become. So people that have Hercules, they have like the cheapest rate and then... Anyone who's Zeus, and I think higher, it's free. Um, Zeus is really hard and expensive to try to get. But the the amount of that it will cost you to get that is so nominal anyway that it's like, meh. Is it worth getting level type of thing? So, so yeah. Two ranks that I think is easy. I don't think I could check here. Yeah, I can't. Not while I'm uh, in dungeons. Uh, I'm just waiting for Z. Ow. Okay, thanks. You just hit me once and that's it? Really? You are a terrible... You are a terrible mob. Uh, 30 seconds left. Yeah. Get Mythic for flying. You should be able to get that relatively quickly if you do, like, votes. Get the pouches. Do dungeons. Stuff like that. And that's if people don't just give it to you for free. Because they... You can win it from voting. Among the, uh, the other ranks as well, so... Four. Three. Two one and I got myself fuel and a pouch the pouch is credits and I got me money okay cool uh oh there's another one there Ooh. oh this is a bad corner no 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 you're not tossing me off the side ow uh, you're in how many minutes? I can't see properly. You're in one minute. Oh, cool. I'll wait for that one as well. Nice. Uh, you I don't like, though. Still? No. No. Tibet. No. No. Tibet. No. Come on. Goodbye. Thank you. Um, so that's looted. Wait for this one. This one's gonna be good to loot very soon as well. That's going to be good. It's less than a minute, so that's perfect. Hmm. I'm going to have to find a way to like backtrack myself a little bit, maybe. More fuel. I do not need fuel anymore.
please do not give me fuel. What? Ow. Everyone's after me because they want my swagger. Um. Ooh. Over there might be a good place to go. I just don't like the mobs that are here. Uh. Here we go. Yep. 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 Uh, is that back to where it was before? Uh, no. That's nine. Let's not die, but let's keep killing these guys. Uh, where did you go and you're annoying? Uh, ten minutes, nine minutes, and... Um, so the plan was with... Um, Mort's gonna keep working on Midnight Sky more. Um, I'm gonna be focusing more on, uh, uh, Skyblock Sun. And, uh, some content is still gonna be done also on, uh, OP Legends when those things come up. There's only two? Really? Um. Why is there only two? That doesn't make sense. Oh, they're literally side by side. Wow, that's a first. No wonder I was freaking out. Okay. Uh, this is a good spot to be in. Um, mostly because the six minute, eight minute, nine minute. Yeah. I'm good at being here for a bit. I'm going to make myself very comfortable here. And then hope that I get the stuff that I need. Um, but that's going to be good. It doesn't seem like there's a lot of people playing in the dungeons right now. Because I wouldn't be this lucky. But just having the 5 minute mark over there is good. Having the... Yeah, just having three of them here. And then I can even backtrack to the other one and get those three as well. No, it's not bad. Hopefully we can get some good items. I'll just have you in the background. May not type and chat as much. That's fine. But I appreciate you chatting and you ask questions. And But don't hesitate to chat with us anytime. It's very much appreciated. But if you could, before you go, send me a nice heart emoji. Eh? That's that's the emoji I've been asking people for uh, for today. Just, just a nice little heart emoji. Only if you want to. You don't have to. Yeah, that works too. It's not an emoji, but I appreciate it. I love it. Yeah. Actually, I, I like that version too. It either looks like a sideways heart or a mouse. Okay, come on. Yeah, emoji one too. Woo. Cool. Uh, so yeah, just... The waiting part kind of sucks, but then, like, once I start moving about a little bit more, uh, we're going to get a lot more. I definitely... <laughs> I could keep fighting the mobs, but I don't want to accidentally get myself killed either, so... That's a little bit the uh, slightly boring part. Uh, but usually there's so many people around that, like, then you're all fighting for the chests themselves. So, I do want to keep... Uh, keep calm. Uh, cool. One more person who votes, and we get another free key. There you go. Free key. Woo. Vote party. F fun fun fact about the vote party. Uh, when they introduced, uh, when they had it early on, it literally was just 100 uh, voting, and people were getting keys left, right, and center. And that was the first season that I joined, and I think it was like season four or five. And I ended up getting two Overlord ranks during that time. And then people were, were saying how it was unfair to increase the uh, vote, uh, the vote party to, uh, to 250. 
and lo and behold, now we're at 450. So you don't get as many free keys as you used to. Um, but you do eventually. Uh, but you do eventually uh, still get a bunch uh, if you AFK. It, it, so I think it's, it's harder now because uh, I will admit MC Hub has lower, like they've lost a lot of uh, numbers, but I think a lot of those numbers were padded by bots, uh, bots or AFK members, but I would say the number is a little bit closer and more valid now. Uh, but because we could, before I would say like there was a thousand people online and I was like uh, 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 on like Skyblock Sun and then a thousand five hundred on, on prisons. And I'm like, I don't think that's accurate. I think the numbers right now are a little bit more accurate. Maybe there's still about a uh, hundred alts that are on as well. Uh, but I think that this is more accurate to what it is right now. Uh, so they're still pretty. They're sitting in good in a good shape, a good active level. Um, of where they're at, and I, and then it's just a matter of like getting the getting them back on track on uh, getting events, get uh, getting proper events, and uh, fixing the mis. I was about to say mistakes, fixing the problems that need to be fixed. And so far, uh, one of the critical things that they've done is I think balance things a little bit, just with the enchantments being the way they are. So I think that direction has been uh, is is been a good one already. Um, and then it's a matter of I'm gonna have to go to that one. Oh no, that's one I already opened. And that's one I will open. Uh, yeah. Three minutes, and then the other one is under a minute. Yeah, under a minute. Uh, better clear the mobs. Here. Oh, I don't have to. Good. Be just a matter of waiting to get this open. Yeah. If I can get a charm, that would be amazing. So long as it's not a smelter charm. Because smelter charm and arms suck. You know if uh, Fade Cloud Prison reset is this Saturday? Okay. Um, I've been trying to jump into a lot of new servers. Uh, it's been hard. Uh, right now, the Midnight Sky is going to be one of the ones that Mort's going to be more involved in uh, when she can be active on her little coffee time. So that's going to be it. I think I'm going to be focusing a lot more, again, on MC Hub. Uh, and then if it's not MC Hub, it's Legends. Diamond. So Diamond uh, Robot and a Legendary Key. That is a good uh, opening. So two more minutes there, and then there's going to be another... Uh, there. So, yeah. We are moving on the right track. I think, yeah, I think there's not that many people in the dungeons at the moment, so I'm getting... A, I'm going to be able to get quite a lot of them uh, this time around. So that's making me happy. Um, uh, I've tried MC Hub. I just hate how you kind of need a G-Kit or a skin to succeed. Skins... Okay, it was a lot easier for skins early uh, before, but you definitely don't need them. Um, I I only got the sinful set that I have right now. Uh, I only got it la the end of uh, not last season, but the season before. And last season, I just didn't play long enough, uh, and that was really because the yeah MC Hub had basically just they made another event, but then they didn't really change anything new. So I was like, no, I'm out. Um, and then started enjoying a lot of the stuff that OP Legends is offering. Uh, does OP Legends, uh, is OP Legends perfect? No. Neither is MC Hub. Neither are a lot of servers. Even Hypixel has its, has its issues. But they all have their own kind of, th uh, pros and cons. And I think that that's where I'm enjoying a lot of the things. Is being able to, like, go between the different servers where I can. Um, but I'm only one person. <laughs> so it's a little harder sometimes. Uh, so Mort's going to be trying uh, a few things. Uh, and then when Morticia has time and gets going on her little coffee time, 
streams that she does she'll be able to work on that and midnight sky is interesting in its own right as well because they do enchantments a little bit differently as well and i like their their pve area and how you can get items there to build out what you want i think that that's a really good direction holy shit 100 fuel okay well i'm definitely i'm definitely good with fuel this time around uh, that one's in 40 seconds. Let's make my way there. Oh, sure. Hi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, I know. You like me. It's fine. Come on. Good, good. Uh, 30. So, dungeons. Is, so, I've got nine minutes to go find the other ones. So, I'm going to probably need to do some backtracking. Uh, or at least go back to the area that had the three that I didn't open. But, uh, I don't know if it's just because it's like one in the morning right now, but I am happy to get the successes that I'm gaining right now for the loot chests. Um, I'd like a charm though. That would be nice, but I'll take a rare key. Why not? All right, cool. Let's get away from the Vex. And... Ow. I immediately failed that jump. Did it again. Cool. Uh, I need to make my way, I think, that way anyway. Oh, someone is showing up, though. That's bad. No, don't fire at me. Uh, whoop. Ow. Okay. Yeah, that's already going to be a problem. I really hate you vexes. Oh, there's another one still? Oh no, it was the same one as before. Darn vex. Um. Ow. Okay, vexes. Please stop being vexes. Uh, yeah, gonna make my way as much as I can. Ouch. Okay, yeah, okay. Out. That. I needed to use the set ability to try to get going. Uh, is there a direction that I can go? I think it's that direction that I can go. I'm gonna heal this though. What well, did I level up anyway? Oh, my Grider Sword. Oh, okay. I was like, D -d -d uh? <laughs> I did a thing? Uh, let's just eat you right now. Ow. Yeah. Stop it. Stop, stop it. Stop, stop it. Um. Trying to see if I can find where it says that there's chests. Um. No, no. Nothing nearby yet. Yeah, no, you're gonna thwap me. Good, I can use another one again. Uh, is there a direction that I can go? Uh, looted by a person. Cool. Uh, let's go that way. Oh, Vex, yes. What I don't want because you're gonna slight, you're gonna push me real hard. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Why is there so many vexes? No, go away. Bad vex. Uh, any chests around? Nope. Nope. Okay, let's keep going. Ow. Uh, okay, this is probably the one that I was waiting for before. And they're all opened. Yeah. Goob opened them. Okay, so that's not going to be an area we can go into. Alright, yeah, mobs. You're a bunch of annoying mobs. 
Especially the Vax. Mostly the Vax. Out, really? Okay, so let's go in this direction. No, leave me alone. No, leave me alone. Holy moly, leave me alone. gives fuel. Um, is there anything around here that is worth getting? Uh, no, it looks looted as well. I don't think I'm finding anything new right now. Yeah. Ow. Oh, good. Oh, oh good. Oh, well, you know what I haven't done in a while? That. Of course, you have to come after. Neat. Uh, there is nothing here to guard. Great. That was looted over there. Uh, loads of people... I don't care about. No, go away. Go away. Go away. Uh, good. Another one that I can't get any of the item. Because they've been looted already. But, aside from the fact that there's a bazillion of these guys. Is at least the pouches that are gonna be out. Oh. oh, of course. Cool. Thanks for spawning right on top of me. Yeah, bye. Uh, nope. Nope. Up I go. Uh, no, bad I go. Up this way. Yeah. Yeah, ancient guard, you. Take that. Oh, hi. No. Don't want you either. Go away. Okay, so we didn't get much. Uh, I was hoping to get at least one more. But I will take what I got. Got a free robot. Ow. Uh, got another pouch. Nice. Got another another pouch. Nice. So, the mobs are annoying, but at least I've been getting items overall, which could have been, could be generally worse. I drew in Discord that you have in description. Can't wait to be able to play Scott. Oh, that's amazing. Thank you. I appreciate that you joined the Siblings Den, uh, group. And yeah, definitely ch chat with the group, uh, members that are there. And if you have any questions, uh, don't hesitate to interact. Uh, uh is there anything nearby that I can unlock? That'd be nice. No, no, come on. Come on. Don't. Don't slow me down. Don't slow me down. Oh, that slowed me down. Uh, that doesn't do anything. Uh, someone's already gotten that. And there's already... Okay, yeah, I'm not getting anything in the last minute. Nope. Alright. I got everything that I could have. Um, I'll... It's not... I, I didn't get any charms or anything, but... Um, I didn't die, which is impressive. And I got lots of wins out of that. Uh, yeah, but Blondie, holy crap. She's a beast when it comes to getting a lot of the stuff. But yeah, you know what? 
still got loads of fuel, few keys, got a robot. Uh, and it's a diamond robot, like loads of fuel. And out of the pouches, shards. Ex like loads of extra shards. And just that's just from doing the dungeon. So like I at some point, I'm going to get enough that it's going to be able to get me ahead on what needs to be done. So it's really not a problem. Boom. And then, not that we need to fill this up right now, but... Yay! Literally refilled the barrel. This is maxed out and is good for 18 out? Whoa, hello. Why? Oh, the power multiplier. We got to 100. Did that help us? The power multiplier. Oh, that kicked it. No, that, that didn't kick it that high. Uh, we did get a 50 more. Well, anyway. Did we not? Oh, no? I don't know what's going on. That's crazy. I love it. Wait, 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 wait. No, it's because he added. Yeah, that's what happened. Okay. Oh, man. I was about to freak out. No, we got another legendary one that he, uh, that, uh, Thorad added. So that ended up getting us another, uh, equal to mythical. So, yeah, no, that moved us ahead. Okay. Plus, we can put more fuel. Plus, we've got more power. That's that's insane. We are... That's all from, like, grinding and just going to, to dungeons and stuff like that. So, that's really cool. Oh, yeah. Let's see if I can get souls right off the bat. Um, I'm... I'm straight up telling Thorad he has it. Directly. So that's insane. I'm happy about that. Avanish, hello! Uh, minor, 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 minor. Cool. We're not gonna... Nothing to merge and use right now with that. You know what? I'm gonna go to... Uh, actually, fix all first. Boop. Uh, yeah. That was fine. Um, and now I'm gonna make my way... Just see if uh, any of the keys can get me anything special. Um, vote, shards, I'll take five, I'll take 503, why not? Uh, credits, that's fine. As uh, MC Hub Sky block spawner thing changed like no guardian farms, like huge ones. Yes, it is the same as the last two seasons where it's that method. You just have like a regular drop farm. Yes, yes. Okay, good. I've been wanting a collection box. This has been... Yes! Oh! Now, this is where... This is something I've been wanting to... Oh, I'm so happy. This has been taking forever right now. Okay. Um... One thing I want to uh, figure out is the, so it's still three by three. The upgrades are not as bad. Yeah, it's still, it's still expensive, but they, but it already can hold a decent amount. Not really. Current capacity, 2,500. You you get more in a freaking... Um, uh, you get more in a... Uh, in a double chest, actually. 
uh, because if you get, like, looking at cactus, for example, uh, let's go all the way down. So, there's 64 times 9. Well, 64 times 9 is 576. So, each row is, like, 500. So, near 600, but let's just call it 500. 500, it's, like, 1,000, 2,000. 3,000. This can only pick up to this. Actually, less than that. So, that's what's uh, still a little crazy. Will I play this server forever? I doubt it. The word forever is very broad. <laughs> I don't think it's going to be forever. But so long as we keep making it and updating it in the right direction, uh, yeah, why not? But I would like to do other things as well. And if you've seen, uh, ooh, actually, I'm glad you said it that uh, you brought this up because uh, I do want to bring up that this Friday, um, Jordan Vicious is going to join with me. Uh, she's going to be doing a stream at the same time as I am, and we're playing a two-player game that's a puzzle horror game. Um, for those that are aware, I really hate horror games, but I really like puzzle games. So she got me on the puzzle part. <laughs> and it's this game where you're like, one person plays in the future, one person plays in the past, and you have to help each other out. We're going to be streaming each of the perspectives. Um, I'll probably be doing the future. She'll be doing the past. And then what's going to happen is that you'll be able to watch both of them at the same time. Or even at that, where you could do is sync it up uh, afterwards uh like after maybe the stream is over and sync it up at the same time to see like what what puzzle and results we ended up doing to get ourselves to the next step so i'm looking forward to that i think it's gonna be very interesting to kind of get the perspective that way the reason why we're not doing it in one stream is because we shouldn't see the other person's uh results and the only way we can kind of set up the screens and knowing that is that we'd be able to see it so um it it's actually more interesting to be able to like sync up two videos and see that they work in conjunction of it. So I'm looking forward to that. We'll see how it goes. It's a fun little little game. We tested one of the um, the first chapter of it, and already both of us were like, "Uh, where is this going?" So it's very interesting. Uh, we're gonna test that out. That's gonna be for Friday. Um, to do the first uh we're probably gonna do chapter one and two uh just because i think we're gonna go through chapter one a little bit faster knowing that we know what's going on but we're probably still gonna get spooked knowing what we know which is gonna be a pain so look 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 forward to that um but yeah jordan ambitious uh jordan ambitious uh has been someone who's been uh joining me in certain streams um Thorad, you just met uh, today. Uh, well, today <laughs> he's been with us for a while now. Um, he's another uh, person who streams alongside me on my channel. Uh, Mort, <laughs> Morticia, obviously my sibling as well. So we've got some people that we uh, we interact with. Uh, but then there's others that I'll be introducing as well. Uh, at some point, Venom. <laughs> we've been waiting on venom for a thing for a while i know he we're going to be doing content with him regarding borderlands so that's been in the plans for a while now so just waiting for him he, he did have a medical thing that happened recently so we're just waiting for him to get back uh, a little bit healthier and having a, a good time schedule and we'll probably sort things out to uh redo our plan for that one is to play borderlands from start for borderlands one all the way to borderlands and beyond type of thing so it'll be very interesting to see where things go from there uh and move, moving us forward so yeah loads to discover uh i don't actually need this yet but i'm gonna leave this guy here so that whatever gets killed nearby oh the cactus is already wow the cactus gets picked up this is So, first of all, Finster was never, like, the official owner. Um, so, it was just, like, a, an agreement between 
stuff. I think he invested a little bit, but yeah. Uh, a lot of things have changed on that. But that's what I was talking about before as well, is a lot of people were... You, you, were the numbers were never super accurate because there were people that were... Um, there was a lot of alts. Like, uh, alt accounts that were on the server. So that was already kind of padded. Uh, the numbers have gone down, but it was... The numbers gone down before uh, people were leaving. And that the reason people were leaving is because there wasn't many big changes happening. Well, obviously, they're making those changes and those changes are working. So, guess what? When a game is fun, people go to it. When a game is not fun, people stop playing. Uh, and that's what's been happening right now is that uh, people are coming back. Uh, there's actually a handful of uh, longtime uh, players from before that used to play uh, that had stopped that had come back as well. And you still have uh, some of the more hardcore players like Fresky, Blondie, uh, their whole gang of people that are still playing as well. Uh, I think QT is also another one. And apparently I was the one who introduced them to MC Hub. And they are still... Uh, yeah, QT 1v1 all game. Uh, so they're still around. Mr. EG Plays has been around for a while now. Uh, I think Dresser returned. He's one of the, I think, people that returned. Uh, and there's loads... But the numbers ha did diminish, but I think that that's not a bad thing. Um, and I think the server, I think Marco, who's, who's kind of gone back to getting things sorted out, is making like he making the right changes moving forward um, for the server. Like a lot of people were PvP players. Well, guess who left the PvP players? Because they, Marco just removed the point. Like, PvP, there was no point in it for Skyblock. Or, not so much that there wasn't a point. But, if you focus on PvP on a Skyblock server, you're why, why are you making it a Skyblock server at that point? Make it like a survival, make it a PvP arena. Like, do something that would be more, like, functional to what that would be. Uh, they... They got rid of Pixelmon, but that's, I think, part of it was because of the, um, the person who was, go who was helping develop Pixelmon kind of, I think it was going in the direction they thought it was going, and because of that, that got stopped as well. Um, and it was just not built, uh, fully right from the get-go, and I think that caused problems as well. Uh, survival is another thing as well. Uh, do you have some partnership with MC Hub? Like, do you have... Nope, not at all. And actually, I've never gotten one. The closest I've got... I've had a few people offer. Uh, but MC Hub... And most places that I do content on... Uh, at least at this time, I have not been partnership uh, or sponsored at all. Uh, some I just have good relationships with. Right now, I have a really good relationship with uh, the uh, execs for OP Legends. Um, Marco, I don't think even knows who I am. But I did have a lot of communication with Tech Mullet at the time. But Tech Mullet's no longer uh, involved. I have a lot of communication with the mods, though. Uh, so a lot of full uh, long-time players and stuff are aware of who I am. So uh, when I say hi, a lot of people are like, oh, hey, hello. So, like, they know that I've been around for a while, and they know that without me even needing to promote myself, they know that, like, if I'm live, I'm live. If I'm not, I'm not. Um, and they'll go check it out if they they want to type of thing. Um, yeah. Uh, would it be cool if I got partnered? Sure. But my content for MC Hub from the beginning has been honest. It's been showcasing what you can do without paying. It's it's providing uh, help for people that needed to understand things because uh, MC Hub has no like real tutorial. Uh, so the content that I have is very much breaking down what it is that you can do, what you can try, 
what will help to give what understanding there is to play on the server to players that are brand new and to be able to jump in and have fun uh, without being confused uh, immediately. And I mean, the last live session that I did uh, or video, it might've been a video actually, or a very short live session uh, was actually me criticizing MC Hub. Uh, I have no problem with calling out actions I don't think is right. And what was the big issue for the last while on MC Hub was they would do an event, it would bloat the economy, it would ruin the experience, and it wasn't fun. Um, it was fun the first time uh, when they did like sort of the um, the 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 pilgrim run thing, um, but like immediately we were breaking the game, and I made a video of that. Like, hey, cool, you get this set. And you have endless keys forever just by farming. And it was nuts. It made no sense. It destroyed the economy. It destroyed, like, the direction of where things were going. And it was just really unfair. Or not even that it was unfair, but it was just not fun. Well, you need to find smaller, uh, very active uh, servers. But yeah, that's how I found OP Legends, and that's how I've been able to uh, work with them, talk to them. Uh, I've already gotten calls with the owners there, and they're they're pretty positive as well. But they have things to fix just like anyone else. Hypixel has things to fix like anyone else. Uh, Akuma MC has things to fix like anyone else. Like no one has a perfect server, as far as I'm concerned. Um, but what they can do is move forward and improve things where they can and what mc hub has done this uh this season is a lot of stuff that i think that fixes what mistakes that they made before um or at least change the dynamic enough that it is more uh more in line to what skyblocks feels like and they did a good job with the enchantment system being put into place. I think it was a bold move and a, the right move for a non... But again, this is coming from a non-PVP player. So take that with a grain of salt. But I think it makes sense that they did away with PVP and went back to the focus of, hey, this, the point of Skyblock is for the Skyblock to be where you're making the money Oh, I've got hiccups now. Oh, no. But the sky block is what's going to make your money. So you need to build the stuff on the sky block to be able to move forward. Not pay someone coins to give you the transfer of all the credits. And then, oh, look at that. I'm number one. Like, while it was still not the worst pay to win thing to do, because you still needed someone to be able to grind all that money to, for someone to buy it off of someone, it was very like unfair that someone could just come in. Here's a bunch of gold coins. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme. I'm number one now. Uh, thankfully, though, they're ha the most of the time, uh, the active players that are ahead have been uh, active players in general. So, but if you take a look, uh, island levels. Yeah, 500. I think I think it's going to take a while for people to reach high uh on the on the levels. And the fact that IS uh IS top right now dividing range on 136 uh like they're making in the millions but they're not like yeah, the, the billions make sense too. Like even we've reached uh being able to get a billion uh but like that's us building out our things as well. It's going to get to a point where everyone's going to be very close to each other on trying to get, uh, trying to move forward. And the very, 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 very active players are going to be the ones moving forward and stuff like that. Um, people have offered partnerships and I've rejected them straight up. I'm not interested in promoting a server that I don't think has uh, potential. 
or that is scamming uh, players. I want them. I pers I am very personable when it comes to things, and I would like to see things being fair but fun. I, that goes for even paying players, by the way. If a player is paying, that should be fair as well and fun for them in a fair manner, but not in a way that it just like supersedes all of the things. Like it's not a matter of well they paid, so they should be able to skip the line. No, I think the direction of where what MC Hub has done, if you take a look at like Coin Shop, and you look at the ranks, Zeus two times multiplier. Hercules 1.9, Sky God 1.6. Like this is a big, this is a bit of big jump, but if you go to like the price of it, uh, fifteen thousand gold coins for Hercules is not cheap. That's about I think fifty bucks, fifty Canadian at least that I know of. Um. And then even Sky God Plus is that. But then Zeus is like 95,000. Are you nuts? Um, but that's a, but if you look at what you actually get, you don't really, um, you don't get that much more than that. Oh yeah, Sky God Plus does get a custom nickname, yes. Um, and while the multipliers are there, the multipliers are by point. 0.1 numbers going up not like some other places where it's like oh that's that's 1.1 1.2 1.3 five times like it's just sneaky thank you very much have yourselves a wonderful night and rest well so yeah i think out of the uh the servers that i have seen so far the scale for ranks and what is offered has been more fair for uh, on MC Hub than other servers, as far as I've, I, I believe. Although I've seen other servers do other alternatives that I kind of like as well. OP Legends, for example, they give out free... Uh, you can get a rank during the season fairly easily through basic grinding. You don't get to keep it, but just by grinding and building your things normally, you get that rank for that season. I think that's actually pretty decent. Um, and you can get some pretty reasonably high ones as well. Um, and then that's on top of like the players sometimes just being very generous and giving out the um uh giving out like a kits and items and stuff as well. Uh yeah, great thumb. Yes. Uh, okay, so I'm at 74. Ooh, 7. 74%. This is going to be better. Oh, it's so good when the farm is, like, still pretty much intact the whole time. I'm going to stop if I can level it up. Please give me thumb complete. No, oh fine, crop drill. I'm not gonna argue because I'm gonna need crop drill anyway. Get me the extras that I need. Yeah. I'm um, actually I'm gonna ice vault my shards because I think we're, I can get um, Thorad to upgrade the uh, collection box getting the collection box fixed up is going to be we're going to need two of those at least but getting a, a, even one collection box working is going to be a huge deal we still need the condensed wand, but that's going to get us going in the right direction, I think. Yeah, so at the end of the day, 
If you're not enjoying a server, don't play it. If you are enjoying it, play it. Um, I enjoy, I, I'm enjoying again at the moment where MC Hub is going. I'm enjoying the direction of where OP Legends is going. Um, both are different and the same in their own rights. Both have pros and cons in their own rights. And I'm going to probably keep an eye on both of them for a while right now. MC Hub being the newest thing. I'm spending a lot of time here and I'm having fun. And it seems to be doing a well, good showcase for people as well on what it is that they're looking to play and try out as well. Um, so I think that's going to be good in general. But we'll see where um, where things go. Um, I do know that OP Legends is going to have things change on their own. They ask uh, on a regular basis, and I do help um, there where I can. And I look forward to seeing uh, them progress that uh, while staying within their their image of what they want the server to be, uh, what they want it to to move forward with, and it's gonna it's, it's gonna work itself out, I think. Um, some servers it didn't work out or it didn't work the same way. Um, if you saw a while ago, Swerve had made a server, a uh, nice guy, but unfortunately his server became way too, uh, pay to win and it, it became way too, um, there's too many faults still happening with it. And there wasn't a good balance with the eco and uh it was also having some trouble with um like a large amount of toxicity uh things kind of evolved and it did what it did but it got switched hands to someone else who um i don't remember where it went to now but uh we'll see where it goes and how it progresses but it is what it is at that point so content wise uh, if the server's not fun and or i'm clearly i can already like finish doing reaching what i was able to reach um if it it just becomes an afk situation i don't think it's fun and i think that's what this this seasons of mc hub is doing right is that you have to grind to build up your equipment um and you can't just do it by getting uh enough shards from someone and bada bing bada boom you've got the best gear the fact that like you have to grind for example farming right now and get things moving forward is what's really uh stepping the going to the next step uh and it's and it's like is it am i doing the same thing over and over again sort of but I'm also seeing the improvements, seeing the progress that's happening. My my equipment is getting better. And once my equipment is full, I know what I can build next to get to the next step. Um, and if I want to, I could be a hardcore grinder and grind it. And that's a decision as well. Like there are players that like doing that. But then I can also be like, go to the next step on what I want to build or do as well. And actually, one of my things is just designing, uh, having the direction of where I'm going to design stuff as well. So it all is relative at that point. Um, I just really wanted to have a good live session. And I think showing off the dungeon, even getting a good introduction with uh, of the new, uh, a new member, uh, alone not... Sh I am pronouncing that incorrectly. I'm sorry. Alonchika. You can tell me in the chat, in the Discord, how to pronounce that properly because I hate butchering names. I'm so sorry. Uh, but really awesome that there's going to be another player due to the stream. I hope you do enjoy it. If there's anything, reach out and uh, poke us in the Discord. You'll see there's, a, there's some members that'll be glad to help you. Alona. Oh, well, that's easy enough. Yeah, Alona. Woo. 
Uh, so, Lona, thank you very much. Uh, thank you for joining the Discord. But I think I'm going to wrap it up today a little bit earlier. Um, <laughs> I don't think I'm going to do another 13-hour th uh, stream like I did last time, uh, given that YouTube doesn't like anything past 12 hours. Um, but uh, I do want to... Uh, uh, I, think I, I think I covered a lot of the bases. Um, I'm probably going to... Probably going to do another live stream tomorrow. Who knows? Uh, or given what time it is right now, later today. Uh, so we'll see where things go. But thank you, everyone, who joined today. Uh, it's been great. Have yourselves a wonderful night. Morning for some of you as well. Rest well. Be safe. And I'll chat with all of you in Discord. Or I'll talk to you guys another time. Bye, everyone. Woo! I got, a, I got a sandwich to finish, too. I'm hungry. I'm going to go do that and finish that. Woo! <laughs> Have a good one. Bye.